time before we even started so if this is the end now baby know that i gave it my all i'm leaving us i won't give up on you i will be holding you hope you believe in us we don't give up on you and if you leave me Hey guys, how are we? How are we? Let me go through and say hi to everybody. Hi Darla, congrats on getting first. Hi Kenzie, hi Tabby, hi Elle, hi Chrissy, hi Sharon. How are we? How are we? Kenzie, take me off the TV. I'm just going to say that right off the bat. Take me off the TV. Yes. But anyway, happy Wednesday. Happy 100 Baby Day. How are we doing? Don't you nope me. And hi, Sabine. How are you? How is your day going? I'm curious. I'm, I'm curious how you guys are voting on this prediction. All right. So 68% said pink. 32% said blue. All right. All right. I'm very interested. All right. So... Oh, you had your first part of exam today. Oof, I'm sorry. Hopefully it went well. Hopefully it went well. I can see I don't try to match my drinks with my shirt. I grab the shirt and then I grab blindly from the fridge. And then I'm like, oh, okay. And then I come sit down and do the poll. I don't change my shirt once I realize what I'm wearing. So, yeah. Um, I am going to have to do eye drops a little bit more than normal today um, because this side is really struggling. So we may have to take a couple of uns like more than like every hour. We'll see how it goes though. Um, no. So today I chose the shirt because it's goes to my elbow and I love elbow shirts this time of year at least. So um, that was why I chose it. I pretty much yelled. I was like. I asked, I asked Google what the um, temperature was today. So, yeah. I, I, I decided my shirt based upon how what the temperature was going to be. And it said it was going to be 60, 69? I think it said 69 and I was like, okay. It's 59 right now, which... Oh, it's supposed to be 71. Yeah, so that's even better. Even better. Uh, I only have like three colors of like elbow length shirts. And this is the only one that matches um, a color that I could potentially have in, in a drink. So. Hi, Sin Twin. Can we get a happy birthday in chat for Sin Twin, please? Oh, Chrissy, I'm sorry to hear that. That's never fun. That is never, ever fun. But yes, happy birthday, Sin Twin. I hope your day is going amazing. I hope you're having a good day. Um, It's 71. Nice, nice. Nice, nice. I mean, it's always great to have a warmer day. It is. Okie doke. Uh, make sure you guys are doing the prediction. Make sure you're grabbing the um, bingo cards. Make sure you've got your bingo cards. If you haven't done bingo with us in a while, it's over on the side. You just... Somewhere over here. Um, You have to work 10 hours today. Ooh. Mm, mm -mm. No, that, that's a pass. That's a hard pass. I always take my birthday off. Always, always, always take my birthday off. I did, yeah. No, nope, I can't. Misbehave. Maybe I'll let it expire since you be book shaming me. No. I was not book shaming you. I was not book shaming you. What the heck? All because I said you shouldn't read the ending of a book first. What the heck? 
Thank you for that, Sam. No, I was not book shaming. Nope. Nope. Maintain I was not. Can't be floofy all the time. I'm not, I'm not floofy. I am not floofy. What is this? What is this? Mm -mm. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Um, for those that are confused, Sam and I were talking about, um, books. Because I said, uh, no Fifty Shades of Grey, because I'm very anti that book series. Um, I'm pretty sure I've ranted about it on stream. If not, I'll rant about it, like, many times more. Um, but the, I, I don't even remember how we got on the topic of it. But then we're talking about how she reads books, and apparently I was book shaming. I was not. But for those that don't know, I am very, very, very firmly anti Fifty Shades of Grey. I am very upset and annoyed that it's gotten the attention it has. Because it's nothing more than a glorified, terrible fan fiction. Um, and it's a Twilight fan fiction. That was originally called Master of the Universe. And it wasn't, so, it wasn't bad like the infamous My Immortal was for the Harry Potter fandom because that was that was bad but that would be so bad it became like good um if you've never read the my immortal <laughs> let me let me give you an example hold on um hang on let, let me read you the um okay so it centers around a female vampire character called Ebony Darkness with an apostrophe between dark and this. Dementia Raven Way. And she's in love with Draco Malfoy. It is one of the worst things I've ever read in my life, but it was so bad that it was good. So, I mean, it's, it's such... I, there's no way that someone wrote it meaning for it to be taken seriously. There is absolutely no way. Um, and the interesting thing is no one's been able to confirm who the actual author is. Um, there's someone that people guess and like they have the biggest claim like the best claim to being the author for it um but pe most people prefer just to like say it's an unauthored like no one knows the author of this but i would have rather that have gotten a book series and like a movie deal over 50 shades yeah oh you found this girl on tiktok that acts out fan fictions from 2009 oh I used to write fanfics. Y'all will never see my fanfics or anything like that. They've they've all been taken off the internet and hidden away in a binder on on paper. Yeah. Uh, how is Fifty Shades like Twilight? So Fifty Shades was originally um, a Twilight fanfiction called Master of Disguise. Master of Disguise, I think. Yeah, and all all the author did was. Um, Changed all the names. That's all she did. She didn't do anything else. She just changed all the names. So that way it couldn't be... It couldn't be uh, the fan fiction. So yeah, Christian Grey is Edward Cullen. So sorry if I destroyed your fantasy. Christian Grey is a very out of character... Poorly written Edward Cullen. Yeah. It, it Yeah. Mm -hmm. And somewhere online, I'm sure someone saved the original version of it. And Anastasia is Bella Swan. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. It is. It's exactly it's yeah. Oh, and there's 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 specific sections in Fifty Shades that is word for word the same as in the Twilight books. 
Like, there's entire paragraphs that the author took from the Twilight books and plopped it into the Fifty Shades books when she was writing it. So, yeah, like, Fifty Shades is fully plagiarized off of Twilight. It's like the NC-17 version of Twilight. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It confirms why they kind of look like, yeah. Um, you sure they're not by the same author? No, they're not. They are not. That that was something that uh, Tumblr investigated early on. Yeah. It. There. Oh, when when that book, uh, when that first got it turned into a book. Oh, I was still on Tumblr at the time, and Tumblr went bananas. I I was just annoyed about the whole thing. Uh, cause there's much better fanfic writers that could have, that should have gotten a book series, but fan fiction writers typically get ignored. But then like, um, have you guys heard of Cassandra Clare and the Mortal Instruments series? She was originally a fanfic writer. Mm -hmm. She wrote about Draco Malfoy. She was actually really good. But when she went to get published, she took down all, of, all her fanfics. So it's next to impossible to find her fanfics anywhere. Unless you go to like... The sub reaches of the internet. Now nah, pass. Um, three and sixty-five. I don't know which one's that. What's that based off of? Oh, it's Polish. Ooh, I will put that to the side. I will take a look at that later. But yeah, no, there, there's there's all stuff. It's just, oh, essentially Fifty Shades, but in Polish. All right. I mean, there's tons of material out there like that. I'm not hating on the materi subject material of the book. I'm just hating on the fact that it's poorly written and it's essentially plagiarized. So, but that's my rant. That's my rant about Fifty Shades. I'm very anti them. But anyway... All right, um, changing topic. Do we want to find out who was right for flavor of the day? Do we want to find out who's who was right for flavor of the day? Yes, all right, well, you got to get your sips in chat if you're wanting to find out. Yep, you got it. You got to get your sips in chat if you want. If you want to find out what what we got, what we have today. All right, hi Frost, how are you? All right, I'm seeing sips. So today's flavor is actually a new one. Um, I saw it on their Instagram and I had to go try to hunt one down. So today, really, I'm in the middle of something very important here. No respect, no respect. Anyway. There you go. Now we went outside. All right. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, today is a new flavor that I saw on Alani's Instagram. So I was like, I need to go try it. Hi, sir. So today's flavor is, it's a pink one, but this is um, their Berry Pop. It's a collaboration with Addison Ray. Who I know nothing about. I just know she's something to do with TikTok. Yeah, I don't know. I don't even know who she is. Um, but yeah. So this is the the can. It looks like it's got strawberries. And it looks like it's got popsicles on the can. And lightning and clouds. So it's cute. Figured we could try it. See if we like it or not. But yes, so if you chose pink, 
You won. Congrats to those that chose pink. It is. It's a very pretty can. And it's metallic, so it's not like the other ones have... Like, this is printed onto the can. Whereas the other ones have a wrap around them. Like a plastic wrap on them. Why is it rigged? Why was it rigged? I'm confused. It's good you had it the other day. Okay, okay. I figured I want to try to have try every single flavor. Uh, the only ones that I have not been able to get my hands on are the Arctic White or the Mimosa. But I'm not really a big fan of mimosas in general. Um, so I don't know how, if I'll like that one or not. We'll see. But anyway. Alright, let's give it a try. Well, I'll give you my verdict. Oh, it smells really good. It's good. What does it taste like, though? I taste a strawberry. For sure, I taste a strawberry. But there's something else. It's like a strawberry candy, almost. I don't know, but it's good. It is definitely good. I don't need that today. Uh, no, I didn't coordinate with Kenzie. I didn't tell Kenzie anything. Kenzie just apparently had the same brain cell as me today. I don't know. I don't know. But yes, Frost, how are you doing, my dear? You're doing wonderful. Okay, good. I had to scroll up to see because... Yohu. Yohu. Don't give me that look. Hey, you know Grandpa's coming? Yeah, Grandpa's gonna come over in a bit. You can go help him. Alright. Oh, and also, yes, my stepdad is coming over to fix the sink. So I may have to help him. I don't think so. He said he doesn't need my help. But he's taking apart a sink, so he may... He may need an extra hand with something. I don't know. We'll see. But, all right. So, we did that. Now, who wants to do bingo? Oh, Slashies, if you want to do bingo. I can't find a bingo emote. I was looking around for a bingo emote, and I couldn't find one. I was very sad. All right. Bingo time. Alrighty, I'll give everyone a second to grab bingos if you haven't not already. Oh, and yes, Wyatt did reply. That reminds me, what did he say? All right, he says, dot, 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 I hate it here, dot, dot, dot. And then he says, there's no accounting for taste. So, yeah. To which I told him, just don't, just don't end up in jail. And he's, uh, he's like, what laws could I break just sitting at home? I was like, I don't know, but I'm sure you could find one. Yeah, that, that sounds like it sounds like him. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's it's definitely like definitely abbreviated, <laughs> as we all know. It, I I had to censor some of the stuff that he said. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You felt that would be his answer? I mean, it, it kind of is. It kind of is. So, it, it's him. 
Anyway. Frost, ma'am. 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 A frost is gorgeous and stunning. I just saw what fr what Frost tweeted. And you look amazing. I just retweeted it because it, more people need to see it. Um But yes. You you look gorgeous. You look absolutely gorgeous in that. Yes. 100%. 100%. So if you would like to see, it's on my Twitter. In case you're not following Frost. Which actually... <laughs> Alright, bingo time! Bingo time! All right. Uh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Time to do some bingo while, while Frost. <gasps> hey, it's Sam's the chosen one. Nice. Congrats, Sam. Good luck. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 Illegally gorgeous. Yes. Agreed. Agreed. All right, our first one is Magikarp. You would think I wouldn't be retweeting that, Frost, you silly. Pidgey. Primeape. Arcanine. Charmeleon. Vile Plume, Vulpix, War Turtle, Metapod, Ivysaur. Yes, Sam has names for all of these. Chansey. Flareon, Jolteon, come on, give us an in, Kangaskhan, give us an in, there we go, Lickitung, Licky Licky, Sunny, oh yes, Sam, at some point we, we, we definitely want you to read the bingo out for us, because we think you're, you're, descriptions i had to think of what word i was looking for would have been fantastic and welcome on in sunny welcome on in how are you how was your stream what did you get up to we are just doing a round of bingo to get warmed up before we head on into hunter baby no sam we love these we love these nicknames love them um but yeah welcome on in we were last doing minecraft i've actually never played minecraft but I watch people play Minecraft, and so it's kind of odd that I don't play, but I've seen people play. I don't know. But anyway, welcome on in. I hope you had a fun, fun stream. Uh, Pink Licky Boy. That That's that's fairly accurate for Lickitung. Porygon. Raichu. Really? Eevee! Crystal Eyeball? How do you get a Crystal Eyeball out of Porygon? Alright. Alright. Zapdos. Magnemite. Okay, we got another N. Clefable. Blastoise. Where's our Squirtle? Lapras. 
Mr. Mime. Nido King. All right, so this one's just all over the place today. I don't know what's going on with it. Charizard. Give you Angry Fish. Which one's Angry Fish? Scyther. Uh, which one's Angry Fish? I gotta find Angry Fish. Oh, you need Gyarados. Okay. Do we have Arbok? Nido Queen. Okay, you need Onyx and Wyatt. Oh! Just coming in with a bingo. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So close. Blue Angry Chompfish. Uh, yeah, that's Gyarados. You needed Ivysaur. All right. Yeah, this bingo was pretty much all over the place. I mean, looking at Sam, she needed Anxiety and she needed, um... Which one was this? Dragonite. And then she needed Articuno or Dragonite. Or she needed uh, Squirtle and uh, Ratatata. So, yeah, these were all over the place today. I don't know. You just needed Ponyta. You don't need anxiety. You have enough. I mean, facts. But, all right, so Jess, congratulations. It looks like you are the only bingo winner today. The only one. So, y'all just see that? That was weird. I may need to reboot my computer. Hmm. I'll do that after stream. Um... All right, so there you go. Congrats, Jess. You got a thousand popcorn as well as you got onto the leaderboard, or you bumped up on the leaderboard, I should say. So, looking at the leaderboard for the month, K Vogel's still number one uh, with Gaming Noom and Kenzie right behind. Then 007, Shell Pot Pie, Munchkin, and Ribaz are tied. And then Jess, you're up there with 12. Uh, Sabine with 11. Slu, Sintwin, and Amora, and DuckDuck. Tied with eight. Frost and Wyatt tied with seven. And Sharon, K-Dawn, and Sinia tied with five. So, yes. Do we know if the update fixed weddings? I actually don't know. Hold on. Um, let's see. Let us. We'll pop over to The Sims and we'll, let me... Look around here. I know we had the, um, this is the Neighborhood Stories update. Which, if you didn't see before, there's a Neighborhood Stories update. I've got, that's really weird. Okay. Um, so, we'll be able to do that. We'll look at, we might, we'll see what that is. Um, there's seven new scenarios, which I'll probably ignore. Um, but bug fixes. This is what we want to know. All right. So we fixed an issue that caused wedding venues not to be available for base game weddings. All right. Um, let's see. Simmer should no longer see the happily ever after outcome for the engaged in conflict scenario. All right. So they fixed a lot of scenario issues, it looks like. All right. Um, so a specific hairstyle will now be visible and create a sim. Um, let's see. Calling off an engagement will now count towards the villainous Valentine aspiration correctly. All right, so, um, if you get a call, you'll no longer be called by a neighbor sim and asked about becoming friends with another active household sim your neighbor's never met before. All right. It'll be much clearer for friendly relationship calls now, whether the sims get together is of a platonic or romantic nature. Thank you. We need that because we get some pretty sus calls. For our, our 100 baby. Alright, so NPC Sims will, no, will also have sufficient, sufficient confidence now. And will no longer call your Sims asking for permission to be friends with their own spouse. I didn't know that was a thing, but I'm glad they fixed it. Okay. Um, okay. 
Uh, so seasons up uh, seasons bug fix your sims who are right on time to activity minutes are no longer chastised for being late didn't know that was a thing um uninvited sims no longer walk into your sims house to catch up after your sims fame increases didn't know that well kind of we kind of have that issue but with the cakes have them stop coming in and making cakes or making concoctions please Um, okay, so apparently some cows and llamas were getting stuck in inventories. They fixed that. Um, selecting teach seed yoga in directions now cancels practice yoga. Um, performing ask the career interaction with a conspiracy theorist will no longer cause a llama icon to show in the Sims career tab. Why would you fix that? That sounds cool. All right, so my wedding stories. Here we go. Uh, ceremony interactions are now available when doing a vow renewal or reception at another Sims home. That's not okay. Uh, Sims should now show up in their appropriate attire for wedding ceremonies. Okay, that's partial fixes. Vow renewal is now avail now only available to married Sims, and wedding ceremonies only available to engaged Sims. All right, but um. How about, like, them actually being able to get married? Because I've seen a lot of people who haven't even been able to get married because the Sims don't go to where they should. Fix that, please. All right. So, apparently ghost Sims were not coming back to life when you were using the wishing well. That has since been fixed. Um, and bust the dust kit. Sims no longer get the rage cleaning angry moodlet when bust the dust is disabled. Um, they also optimized vacuum cleaners so your sims won't need to fight dust every day. Wait, you mean they're actually fixing one of the broke, one of the most broken things that they gave us? I don't know. I don't have busted dust. So if you have busted dust, let me know. Did they actually fix anything? All right, so looking at the laundry list, it looks like they've only fixed. They've only fixed two things on the laundry list. Guests arriving in the proper clothing and wedding venues appearing. That's it. They haven't fixed anything else. So, um, they do say that there is another patch coming soon. So my guess is we're get, they're going to fix those then. I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. But okie dokie. So for those that don't know what's going on and haven't been here for a while, um, we are now... We are now in Newcrest. So, we've finished set one. So, set one was TV shows. We finished that. And um, then we just finished set two on Friday. So, we have now moved on to set three. Um, and this house is on the gallery if you would like to download it. This is called the Newcrest home. So, each of the homes are uploaded and they're titled according to what world they're placed in, in this save. Now you do not have to place them in the same save as what I did. Um, I just labeled them so that way you could pair them up with what we are doing in game. Um, yes, so we are pregnant with the first one. She's in her first trimester. She will be in second trimester in 14 hours, so about i'd say 1 or 2 p.m on saturdays when she'll enter the second trimester um but this one was georgia kincaid's child so yes all right um the first thing we're gonna do i know bud go say hi i know go on go on bless you go on Go get him. 
Uh, I know. Go on. Go get him. You are so silly. Uh, now, we do have a little bit of a problem, though, guys, because uh, um, Gru is going to age up in three days. No, two days. Yeah, three days. And um, Gru's skills are so close. So, um, you know who that is. Go on. Go on, go get him. Go on. What? Wrong way. Um, wait, where is, ah, uh, here we go, thinking. So he needs to do thinking. Shapes. You need to roughhouse with him, otherwise, I don't know what he's going to do. Probably. All right. Um, and then we have, cause y'all were rude and mean to me. Fantahiro? Fantahiro? Did I say that right? I don't know if I said that right. Someone correct me if I'm wrong. And, um, do you need, yeah, we're just going to put her to sleep. Put her off to the side. Um, we have Wanda upstairs. So, yeah, Wanda go to sleep. And then we've got Willy Wonka. Who, Willy Wonka is the last of the movie set. So, yeah, y'all decided you were going to choose Chaos. Oh! Um, oh, it's not this one. This one is sort of mimicking... The bathroom that I cannot wait to use in the um, Glimmerbrook home. But it, she's got a shower and um, bathtub set up in here. So, yeah. It's, it's, it's a very cute room. She's very yellow. So, um, the first house was very blue. This one's very green. And the... Uh, no, this... So the first house was very blue. Uh, the Sulani house is very green. This one is very yellow. And then the um, fourth house, I believe, is nature-based, if I remember correctly. Uh, thank you. Yes. So for those that have not met our matriarch before, once she gets out of the shower, I'm going to have her come sit here. Come sit. Um, and Meek Jim and I thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Um, uh, and Hash I Love Flowers, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. So, for those that have not met her before, this is our matriarch. She's had 50 children. She's pregnant with 51. Uh, why are you saying you're hungry? I don't know why you say you're hungry. Whatever. Um, she does need to start painting, though, because we only have 324 simoleons. So, clean everything up, please. And then I'm sending you out here to start painting. Now, what I wanted to ask your guys' opinion is, should we just sell them when we're done? Or should we do yard sale selling? So, I'm going to do a poll for that. How to sell paintings. So, do you want to sell them as they finish or at a yard sale table? It is up to you guys. All right. Group, get up. Get up and go do your thinking, please. I'm going to need you to go think. Okay, thanks. Hold up. No, you're supposed to go paint. Go paint. I'm gonna lock this, lock you in here. Lock door for everyone. I'm gonna lock you in there so you have to paint. We don't need you at the moment. All right. So, yeah, guys, if you don't see the poll, you may have to refresh.
Alrighty. Okay, good. Now she's painting. I don't know why she didn't want to do that before. But, come on, get your thinking up. You're almost there, kiddo. You There we go. Okay. Now potty, cha potty chain. Uh, two ought to do it. But, oh, we also need to start putting the birth certificates up. I forgot about that. Oh, hold on. I got to do... There we go. All right, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. All right. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. All right. All right, you guys want to do a yard sale table? We will do that then. As soon as she can afford to. All right. Well, that was fun. All right. Actually, you know what? Now, we'll, we'll move this. We'll move this up and over. We'll move all these over. Yeah, we'll move all these over. No sense in leaving a random open space for it. All right. As long as someone can get in this room to um potty train them, we should be good. All right. Wee! There we go. Oh, come on. Don't tell me I'm going to see those all the time. Oh, I'm going to see those all the time right there. I don't know if I like that. I don't know if I like that. We may have to change that. We'll see, though. All right. Are you done with your potty? Oh, so close. You can stop throwing a temper tantrum and go potty. Okay. How poor. All right. Put that in your inventory. Um, so let me unlock this and we'll lock door for everyone but Ariana. Okay. Gru did finish. Super efficient baby care goes uh, nap here. Because I don't think... Do we, even, do we even have a cake? I don't think we have a cake. We do have a cake. Alright. Well, we'll let Gru nap a little bit. Just enough to, like... Not pass out mid... Mid-birth. Oh, wait. No, it's gone now. Okay. I'm happy with that then. I was afraid it might stay up all the time and that would have been bad. Uh, set a curfew for 11 p.m. Because we haven't used that at all. So let's go ahead and use that. Let's set a curfew. We'll set it for 11 p.m. We'll be generous. Um, but that means, too, then the kids can go, like, play out there on the jungle gym, that sort of thing. Oh, that's right. I allowed access to that for family, for household members. I was like, why is she going in there? That's what it was. That's what it was. All right. So how much are the tables? I want to say they were $350. Yeah, so we might have to wait until um, we get our first round of presents in the mail. 
Mallory. I don't know if you guys can see her. Nope, because she stopped in the doorway. Hi, Mal. But Apollo has a has a, a playmate over. Yeah, you're a good girl. Play nice. And hi, Sinan. How are you? How's your day going? Did I? Oh, 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 no, no, no. Mm -mm. How did I not notice that before? Unacceptable. Unacceptable. Okay, it's gone. It was clipping into the house and I there's nothing that bugs me more than plants that clip. So, it gives the flower a bathroom a flower fragrance. I mean, fair. Although, hold on. I'm going to do a Hey Mallory. Mallory, want a treat? That got your attention. Here, hold on. I'm going to let you guys see her cuz she's very rarely over here right now. I know, I know, both of you. We got two for the price of one here. All right, you gotta wait. You gotta wait. You gotta come over here so they can see you because you can't jump up like he can. And then he's... All right, you go take that, go over there. Mallory, come over here, over here. You wait. Enjoy that. Did you enjoy that? Yeah. They're all gone no more. Yeah, you're very sweet. Go on, go explore. Go explore. That does not mean scarf in here. Go scarf out there. Yes, he uh, Apollo has a visitor over. His sister came over. Mm -hmm. So that's Mallory. She's the one dog that Apollo cannot get his way with. Because um, she will sit on him. And it's hilarious. Alright, let's age Goo. Let's, I was going to call him Gus. It's Gru. Let's age Gru up. Uh, candles help from Mom. Yeah, and I gave you guys a freebie treat. You're a good girl. Alrighty. Did you just put him through the chair? Sus. Where are you going? All right, so grew aged up into an erratic sim. All right, what do we think, guys? What do we think? Do we like that for him? Uh, Wiz kid, but he's erratic. Uh, Sam, I think you may know the that movie the best. So tell me, does it fit? Does it fit? Okay, Sabine thinks it fits. All right. All right. All right. So we want to go with it. Um, if you guys are good with it, then we will lock it in. Oh, wait. I did. I did turn all of it on. All right. Yeah. So I will lock it in then in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, we will lock it in. All right, Gru has too much hair. 
Yep, Gru has too much hair. All right, come over here. Uh, add birthday candles, please. No, wait. You are not sleeping on the couch. Uh, we'll give you the robot. But first... We're still getting presents in the mail. All right, we're going to get a lot of money off this kid. All right. Plan outfit. Why are you... Why can't you get up there? Okay, he can't get in the room. Why can't he get in the room? Do I have it locked or something? Go here. Can you not go there? Yes, you can. All right. Okay, so. Why can't you go there? What's in the way? I'm very confused. I'm very confused. All right, we go here. Are right, um very confused here. Hold on, let me teleport you here. Why can't I teleport you? It worked in playtesting. Why are you not able to go he go here? I know you have to pee. Okay, I don't know why they can't go why they can't go in the kids room. Well, that's weird. Gru, get out of your sister's bed. What is this? All right, we're going to put that there. We're going to move this in one. Maybe it... I don't know. We're going to put that right there. We're going to move this over here. We're going to move this over just a little bit. Let's see if that helps. I don't know. But well, we're going to figure it out. Okay. Go to sleep. Can you go in there now? Now you can. But why won't it tell me what you couldn't? I don't know. I don't know. We're going to put that. We're going to put it back like that though. And we'll see. I have nothing else for you. I'm sorry. I don't know. We're, we're going to put him to sleep though. Cause he needs to sleep. We'll see. And hi Mickey. How are you? Uh, so what this is, uh, still technically first gen, but it's our third set of kids. So, uh, we are starting, we are at 50 kids total with the same matriarch. We're going to try to have all the kids with one matriarch. So, all 100 with one. That's what makes it kind of exciting. All right. You need a shower. So, take a shower and then, um, she needs a skill. And mom needs to make food. Okay, she's just standing there like a bump on the log. That's not good. Um, so yeah, so our first set we did, to, our first set of 25 kids, we had them in Willow Creek. Um, our second set, which we just finished on Friday, we had them in Sulani. Now we are, oh, let's do a chicken stir fry. Now we are in Newcrest. So yeah. All right, um, I'm actually going to have you clean that up and I'm going to try to have you come over here when you're done. Let's have her test while he sleeps. Where are you going to take it? You've got th four sinks up here 
any t I don't want to know. And instead of cooking inside, she decides to go cook outside. All right. Um, mop all this, and then... I think it might be the door, which is weird. It's very weird. Very, very, very weird. But here, we'll see what she says. All right, so we're going to have to redo how we have the this right here. All right. I have an idea. I have an idea on how to fix. Uh, thank you, Tiana. Thank you. All right. So... All right, we're going to do this. We're going to do it like this. No, I don't want that. I want this. Come here. Thank you. I want that. I want... Wait, no. I want this. I'm just testing. Well, I probably won't stay like this, to be quite honest. But I'm just testing to see if she can get in now. All right. It might be the punching bag. I think it might be the punching bag, which is sad, but... All right, go here. And go sit. Nope, it's not the punching bag. I bet you it was the doors. The doors were in the way. All right. So we'll we'll figure that out. I'll move stuff around. We'll figure it out. It'll work. We'll make it work. Put that to there. Actually, yeah. We're going to run out of money doing this, but that's fine. Uh, let me see. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't have enough money for that. But if I do this. Get rid of that. Then do I have enough money? I do. Why do I have a ran- I was gonna say, why do I have a random door there? But I don't. Alright. Fix this. And we'll just have to figure something else out for that. So yeah, I bet it- I don't know what it was. But it was working at some point and then it wasn't for others. So. That's fine. It can be like that. That should work now. If it doesn't, then I really don't know what's going on. Yeah, see, now that works. Rude. All right. We got it fixed, though. That's all that matters. Wait, where's the food now? Oh, it's right there. Grab a serving. I was like, where'd the food go? Okay, put that there, because we have a money trash can. That set us back a couple hundred simoleons, but that's okay. All right, now that we have that, go put it in here so that way the toddler can eat. And the toddler is filthy. But, guys, but the difference is in this house, the toddlers can actually get baths. Um, how'd we do that? We just kept going on it. Um, did it clean? Did we get all the stuff? Dunking it. It can go back in there. 
I'm replacing the whole thing. Some point. Thank you. Uh, yeah. It's not been that long since I gave a toddler a bath. I mean, yeah, they don't get fast that often, but dang. All right, go take care of the... She, I'm putting her back to bed. Yeah, because we don't have enough for anything. All right. Um... Oh, she's going to need to upgrade all the beds, too, guys. Oh, man. I'm not looking forward to that. So, because mom's going to be the most important one to upgrade. Yeah, mom, upgrade all of these. Well, that's going to be interesting. All right. So, um, in order to get money to do this, how are we going to do this? Um, hmm. See, there you go, Kenzie. The toddler's getting a bath. And eating a duck at the same time. Alright. Nope, we don't have anything for the Finchwick Fair. Maybe in the next one, we'll let the kids get an animal. I don't know. Maybe we'll have, maybe we'll do like a chickens or something. That could be interesting. That could definitely be interesting. All right. Um, I'm going to have you clean that, though. Because that'll get us 10 simoleons, I think. I think. Yep, we got 10 simoleons out of that. I don't know where you're throwing that away. What are you throwing away? What is he throwing away? Oh, yeah, we have little, we have a little cat. We have a little bunny right there. What are you throwing away? Oh. Okay. Well, there you go, kiddo. Look at you being responsible. Definitely not something I'd expect from Gru. Oh, that's right. He hasn't done homework yet. You having fun? All right, do your homework, kid. Did Wanda do her homework? Probably not. Nope. Wanda did not do homework. Okay, so. Ooh, thinking is almost good. So what's that? Yeah, just come here and what's that to the slide? Yeah. Wait, she's, is she, what, what's her trait? Angelic. Ooh, so we still need someone to potty train her. Well, that's a bummer. Seven. Actually, you can... There we go. Thinking level two. Okay. No, you're supposed to come here and potty train. Potty train. Thank you. All right, so kids are doing homework, toddlers getting. Okay. You go here. All right, potty train. Why are you not potty training? Why are you not potty training? Thank you. All right. Okay. I'm starting to think this house might be slightly cursed, guys. Might be slightly cursed. Just, just a little bit, maybe. Yeah, I'm thinking it might be cursed. This is not a good way to start us off. Not a good way. Not in the slightest. 
All right. Uh, Wanda does need a skill though. What 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 do you guys think that her skill should be? Uh, not that one. Do extra credit work. And hi, Sherry. How are you? I'm trying to think of what her skill should be. We could have her try to... No, that costs money. We don't have money for that. We need to have her do something that doesn't cost money. Doing a little bit, better, little bit better than yesterday? That's good. As long as you're always doing better, you're good. Um, Knitting costs money. You know what? I'm just going to have her play on the computer. Play on that. That'll work. We'll put you to sleep. That way she can just sit and, and pluck music out. Busy with work? Not a problem. Thank you for popping in, Purple. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, hopefully we can distract you a bit. Although this has been a little bit anxiety ridden because it's being hateful. And I don't know why. Actually, you know what? No, we're going to have her come over here. We're going to have her punch the punching bag. That's going to be her thing. She's going to punch the punching bag. Because this is getting on my nerves. Alright, uh, give me just one second, guys. While we're waiting on her to do that. So, give me one quick second. I will be right back. All right, sorry about that. I had to check on a couple things real quick. Um, oh, Sherry, so we are at $351 because we moved to a brand new house and when we moved to a brand new house, our money resets down to zero. Hi, Nao, how are you, my dear? Can we get a shout out for Nao, please? All right, let me think. Oh, I had paused it. Yeah, happy. We, um, we, so anytime we move, that's part of the extreme version. Um, anytime that we move houses, 
Um, it means that we are starting a set over, so therefore all of the money must reset. Did not. One sec. Okay, we're good. I like that. I like that. That was a good way of wording it. Um, so when do you choose to move? Yeah, so every 25 kids is when we uh, go to a new set. Um, we are currently in set three, which is books. Um, and each of the sets is themed. Our first one was TV shows. So all of the kids and dads were named after TV show characters. Um, set two was movies. So that was the kids were and dads were named after movies. Now we are in books. So if you would like to create a dad for this. Uh, there it is. Um, so the universes that are closed for baby for names uh, for the for the dads or the kids um, would be. Harry Potter, Divergent, Twilight, and Fifty Shades of Grey. So those those four universes um, have already been used um, in the challenge, so they cannot be anymore. Why are... You got 22% of the way through and you said you're done. Absolutely not absolutely not you weakling i could go further and i have zero upper body strength absolutely not ah uh. but um so yeah so when we move to when we complete a set we move to a brand new world in a brand new house and um then all of our money goes bye bye so we start over from nothing and also how we make money starts over too. Why are you screaming? But um, you're going to need to paint something else. So if I could have you come out here and paint something, that would be wonderful. Uh, before we do that, though, I am going to move this over to Painter Extraordinaire to see if we can complete this. We're going to try. We're gonna definitely going to try. So, yes. All right. We have, so we have Wanda from Marvel. Then we have Gru from um, Despicable Me, who needs a makeover. When you wake up, you'll get a makeover. Okay. How are you doing on your skill? I purposely did not give them a, um, I don't think I did. No, I don't see one. So I purposely, they do not have a um, basketball hoop because I wanted to try to do it with the treadmill. I wanted to try to get their fitness up quickly with the treadmill. So we're going to test it out. We're going to see how it goes. All right. Once, once you are like past the point of being able to function, I'll let you go take care of your needs. All right. So, oh, we're going to need to have like some sort of lamp in here. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize how. Yeah, she's gonna need some sort of some sort of lamp in here. Hmm. We'll figure it out later. Oh yes, the first one of this one was Georgia Kincaid. Yes. All right, fitness level two. There you go. You still need one more fitness level. But oh. Yeah, I'll, I'll let you go take care of your needs now, kiddo. My bad. My bad. All right. Ooh, 351. Is it a good one? Normal. All right, put it in your inventory. Then I'll let you eat and go to sleep. Uh, did you upgrade everything? You did. Okay, good. So mom will get a, a lot more sleep a lot faster. I am okay with that. 
Okay, so it is time to give Gru a quick makeover. Emphasis on quick. All right, where's Gru? Here's Gru. Mostly we're just giving Gru different hair. Okay, maybe not that one because he looks... Maybe not that one. Mm, maybe. I don't like the hairline. The hairline weirds me out a bit. Not gonna lie. See, that's a lot better. What? Did they leave you behind? He's going to be borkative. I sorry. So what do you think? Should we have him go bald already? Should he be bald as a kid or just go bald as a teenager? What do we think? Should yeah, how how bald should we make him? Should we make him bald now? I kind of like him being bald as a, like a young kid. Oh, hey, look, he's got cute freckles. Oh, wait, that's his sleepwear. Hold on. Do we want him bald? Gru is bald. Let him be bald. All right. All right, we will let him be bald. Although... I think I may give you these these instead. Yeah, I'll give you that instead. Mm, that's not bad. Maybe we'll go with... I like the tentacles, but yeah, we're going to go with these because it kind of matches the shoes and there you go. Oh, wait, that's the same top. You're getting a different top for sleep then. Or no, I'm giving you different pants then. I'll let you be a, 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 a like that sort of, but yeah. Okay. So for your active wear, then you're going to wear that. I don't hate it. That is very on brand. No. I hate when The Sims gives glasses as fashion accessories. Sunglasses are one thing, but glasses, glasses, no. Absolutely not. There you go. That works. All right. That works for you. He's bald. That's all that matters. That is all that matters. Um, Pretty Jaded, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch chair, and get comfy. All right, maybe it's going to load. Do I need to put the song on? I'm going to put the song on if you don't load. Three. That's what you got to do is you got to threaten them. You, you got to threaten them. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, you might, she might need a bath. We'll let her take a shower though. And then we'll let her take an, we'll let her go to sleep. Yeah. All right. 
so Gru, I'm actually gonna have him experiment because I think that's more on brand for him. Yeah, I think that's more on brand for him. Yep. All right, what's mom doing? Mom's not sleeping yet, all right. All right, and then we got a hungry toddler. There better be food for this toddler. There is, okay. So wake up, come get food. What What do you need? Everything. All right, we're gonna have you come talk to the kitty. Hi, kitty. Pet the kitty, nice kitty, pretty kitty. Oh wait, before you can do that, you need to super efficient baby care and then you can sleep. This is the downside of having so many infants. And hi Sarah, how are you? How's your day going? All right, go to sleep. Actually, I do need to set this so only she can use it. Computer, lock computer for everyone but her. And lock these everyone but household. Everyone but household. Everyone but household and everyone but household. All right, that way nobody random can come in and do that. Oh, I'm just doing some homework right now. After that, you're gonna play with the new update. That'll sound fun. That sounds fun. All right, there we go. Oh, goody, the kid's done with it. Now the kid's going to get her communication up. Yes. All right. Give me your plate, please. Thank you. I need the money. All right, we're back up to 351. Yeah, all right. So, Mom, when you're done, I'm going to need you to... Oh, you can do a lot more. Okay. Um, we're gonna have you do a realism painting when you wake up. Okay, good. We're making some money. Don't you light anything on fire. You light something on fire, Gru. I'm locking you in the in the sand pit outside. At least until school starts, and then I'll send you to school. I'll let you come back in the house eventually, maybe. Just don't light my house on fire. All right, communication level two is great. Oh. Yeah, keep babbling to this one. Get, get, your, get your communication all the way up. All the way up, please. Thank you. I don't know why you're not having fun talking to the... Oh, you can't go potty. All right, use your diaper. It's fine. It's fine. Um, You need imagination and potty. So, come out here and play dolls when you're done. There we go. You're done with that. Go play dolls. The benefit of them having two separate rooms, so this room where they sleep and this room, this area over here where they play, is they get their movement up walking back and forth. At least that's what I'm attempting this time. I'm trying to set up each house to be slightly different. All right, so you're up here sleeping. You need fun. We'll let her play video games. That's what we'll do. Play Party Frenzy when you wake up. Or just, all right, play Party Frenzy anyway then. Okay. Gru is Gru. That is true. That is true. All right, come on, get your mental skill up. If you get your skill to level three, I'll let you go eat. 
I was gonna say, how are you not get, having fun playing video games? Who doesn't have fun playing video games? That would be very sad if you didn't have fun playing video games. All right, imagination level two, good, good. And we have an upset infant. Are you done with your painting? You're not done with your painting yet. Oh, well, come, come take care of him as soon as you're done. What are you painting? Um. Hi, King Julian. Bye, King Julian. Um. Why is she painting a gravestone? I think she knows what Vlad is doing. No, Peter, go away, Peter. <gasps> no! Wait. Jeff. Who is Jeff? Grandson. All right, so we got all these grandkids dying. So the kids, I guess because it's their nephew, kind of. But why is she not getting called? And well, at least now it says family member instead of it said close friend before. That or she knew or she's psychic. I don't know if I like that. I don't know if I like that. Where are you going? You do not need to sleep just yet. Come here and play dolls. I need more skills to get to level three before you can sleep. I'm sorry. Wait, how much food is left? Two. Make some salads, please. Yeah, let's make some salads. Yeah, she's a little too self-aware. Just a little bit. All right, garden salad. Party size, thank you. Okay, Gru has gotten this skill up. Oh, Gru needs to pee. Oh, pee, shower, and eat. All right. Well, I'm going to have you pee and take a shower. I'll let you decide what you eat after that. All right. So, again, I'll let her decide food after this. The timing is what's sus. Yes. That, that's definitely the timing. Sid, no, we're not joining any group like that. I'm sorry. It's just not happening. All right, come on. We're almost there. We're almost there. We're 75% on that. Come on. Play with dolls just a little bit more. A little bit more. Get your skill up. Bellabot, read the room. Nope, Shrek, we don't want to come over. No! Leave the toddler alone. Put put the toddler down. Put her down. Put her down. Go sit. Finish playing dolls. She is fine, I promise. Give her a second, get her imagination up, and then you can put her to bed. There we go. Now you can put her to bed. 
Yeah, so come here and read her to sleep. Sure, read her to sleep. That'll work. Oh, wait, before we do that, ah, we'll leave it. It's fine. It's not as if we're not getting, we're not going to get another chance to read a kid to sleep. So do that and then come over here and we'll do another realism painting. We're going to test her. You didn't read her to sleep. You know what? That's fine. You go do your thing. You go to sleep. We, we need this painting, though. Mwahaha! <laughs> All right. We're getting there. <laughs> little by little, we're getting there. Maybe. All right, so, Wanda... Is Wanda not gonna eat? Wanda, come eat. Eat something. Is Has Gru eaten? Gru has eaten. All right, so go experiment and get your get your mental all the way up, please. And thank you. I kind of need your mental to be at level four. Okay. Yeah, she's got time. Now, mom. Looks like she's painting a flower of some kind. Okay. Well, this could be interesting. Are you putting something? Is it just the way that it's... I'm confused by the center of the, of the flower. At one point, it looked like there was a face in it. And now I have questions. Considering all the weird stuff that has happened in this save, I have questions. All right, wait a minute. Was that, wait, that was the flea market. We could have gone and sold stuff at the flea market for free. Please tell me it's, it's done. Till 6 p.m. Darn it. All right. Do we have any mail? I gotta focus on your homework. Not a problem, not a problem. <gasps> Get mail, yes. Oh, and we got, oh, that's right. I had to do a poll because we didn't decide last time. All right, what do you want to do for the naps? Let me know. I just need enough to get the um, art gallery thing. That's it. Oh, look at all those. We Okay, we have enough. We have enough money. All right. I hope there's not a poltergeist hidden in this. That'd be terrifying. That would be absolutely terrifying. I will do a hard pass. So, do we vote for them each week or do we cheat them? We have no neighborhood action plans. So tell me what you guys want to do. We have 3,749, so we can definitely vote them all in. That won't be a problem. It's just, do we want to take the time and possibly forget? So, yeah, let me know, let me know, let me know. Actually, while you do that, I am a little bit chilly, so let me grab my sweater. One sec.
right, you guys want to cheat him. All right, we'll cheat him. So, let's see. Which one do we want to do first? I say rock your body and mind because fitness and hygiene. So, we're going to vote the first one and then we're going to cheat the rest. There's no way they're going to pass that. All right. So, let's sell. <laughs> all right. With all of this. Oh, wait. We can't do that yet. Because I got to open these. I got to open all the seed packets. All right, open all the seed packets. All right, with everything we have here, I'm gonna guess 5,000. All right. All right, did we get everything we did? Oh, I was so close. I was 300 off. Man, all right. All right, we'll sell them. But what's, what are bills? <laughs> we don't have enough for bills. That's not good. But we do now have enough for um, the yard sale thing. So what we're going to... Do. Yeah, okay, we're going to put it back here in the back. So they're going to come in the backyard to, to buy stuff. I don't remember what it's called, so I think it's something gallery. Street gallery, yes. How much? 400, all right. All right, we're going to put it right next to her thing. Oh, and we do need to give her a light out here. I forgot about that. Um, and Toa, thank you so much for the uh, follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch chair, and get comfy. All right, we need some sort of outdoor lighting. I kind of like the idea of string lights. Mm, maybe these, but do it in like the yellow blue. Oh, maybe not. No, those those aren't going to work with that. Wait, I need that. Hmm. What matches the vibe? This might. Mm, not really. What about this? No, that doesn't match the vibe either. Well. Hmm. Oh, wait, we're going to do these. We'll do these. Because then it's a little bit of flowers in here. That should be enough if we do it all the way around. Uh, they're expensive, but they might work. We'll see. And then maybe we'll do just as an added... We'll do one of these. We'll do like that. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's that's definitely bright enough. Definitely bright enough. All right, so throw these in here. 
and come paint another one. Uh, let's do a classic painting this time. Hey, you didn't get a bot this time. Congrats. All right, Gru. So close. Gru is so close. Come on, Gru. You can do it. You are nowhere near. Nowhere near. Back to the treadmill you go. Okay, so maybe the treadmill was a bad idea. Vampires, go away. I don't care. I don't want you here. All right. Oh, no. That barely lights it. That still barely lights it. Man, it's cool, but it's... Hmm. Okay. We're going to need some other light right here. Hi, my sweetheart. Do you enjoy seeing Mallory and Grandpa? Hmm? Alright, well, we'll have to come up with something else. Moving into a new house is always growing pains. Um, and Barbie Princess, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Alright. Yes. Go to sleep. Wait a minute. Wanda stopped exercising. Wanda. Rude. No, you're going to push the limits. Hi, me, Joy. How are you? Happy Wednesday. My sim is fighting me every step of the way, and I don't like it, and I do not approve. Mm-mm. I'm just trying to get her to work out. Yes, I know working out is terrible sometimes, but sit, eat your food. And this house is so glitchy. I don't know why. Has anybody downloaded it and it worked well for them? Uh, because if so, please let me know so I feel better. Because right now this house is so glitchy. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. We're, I'm stressed over this game. So stressed. Uh, yeah, so we've been doing that for all of our previous houses. And I just got tired of doing it. So I didn't give them a basketball court for this one. And I didn't realize like how long it took them normally to do it. Because, like, the Dream Big is sort of, like, my backup, I have nothing else plan. So, it's just disappointing. Alright, come on. You can do it. Maybe. Actually, while she's doing that, come up here and upgrade these beds. Upgrade her bed, at least. Because she's going to need it. I just want to get my kids kicked out. That's it. Um, yes. Yeah, so this is the first house that we've added in, like the knitting or the cro or the um needlepoint stuff. Before we kind of really haven't had the kids do much of anything because we haven't needed anything for the money. Um. So yeah, this one we're kind of testing out new things. All right, so you've done that. Okay, you're almost there. Come on. Almost there. Uh, no, you can work out and push the limits. I know you're filthy, but you are so close to level three. Take a shower when you're done. <laughs> She's so close. Ah. Uh. Oh no, oh no, Willy Wonka. Willy Wonka hath yeeted. Okay, he's a brunette. Who else finds it insanely ironic that Willy Wonka is the child of Peter Parker? Because I do. I find it incredibly ironic. 
All right, so. We've already had bad juju in this house. Give me good juju. Give me good juju. Inquisitive. All right. If we like it, I will lock it in. In. Right. If we like Charmer, I will lock it in. In. Five. Four. Three. Two. All right. Independent. If we like independent, I will lock it in. <laughs> Twin. Independent again. All right. If we like it, I will lock it in. In five, four, three, two. Clingy. And Julianne. All right. So Julianne has the last one. So whatever this rolls to is what we will get. Angelic. Ah, I hate Angelic. At least it's not fussy. I still hate it. All right, Willy Wonka, come get food. You need food, and then I'll let you go do other stuff. Uh, food, and then I'm putting you straight to sleep. You guys did try. You did try. I will give you that. You didn't get to level. You do not get to sleep. I will build a bike thing for you. Go right around on the bike. Get your fitness skill up. Something. Get your fit. Get. Ah. <laughs> Kenzie just wanted me to have a fussy child. That's it. And how is this child so filthy? I don't get it. Come on, you're so close. You are so close. Come on. All right, bike here. You can come home now. Oh my gosh. When was the last time we had a fussy toddler? Um, oh, we haven't had one in a while. The last one was Cameron. Baby number 35. All right. Um, oh, Fanta uh, Hero is angelic as well. All right, so she is eating. What is mom doing? Mom is, oh, mom is sleeping. Yeah, mom, you get some sleep. You get some sleep. Yep, go do that. Yeah, yeah, that's probably for the best. Yeah, all right, so, um, you go do shapes. Uh, yeah, you come sleep. Where, where'd you put the, where, where are you with the bike? Give me the bike back. You don't get to keep the bike. That was only for this. The bike stays here. All right, you, you go to sleep. The good part is that bed is fully upgraded. So... You'll get more sleep than you would normally. 
I don't know how much you're gonna actually get before school, but I'm hoping you at least get into the yellow. Yeah, I'm gonna hope you get into the yellow before you go to school. Mm-hmm, yeah. Nope, because you gotta go to school. You're going to school a mess. Yeah, she's going to school a mess. I'm gonna push it till it goes into the yellow. There you go. You're in the yellow. Go to school. I am so terrible to my kids. I will be shocked if she ages up. I will be absolutely shocked if she's ready to age up by the end of this. Yep. Yep. All right, Gru's off to school. Good for you, Gru. Okay. Um, yeah, so... <laughs> How much food do we got? We got enough. All right, you are gonna, she's gonna end up using her diaper. It's fine, it's fine. We are gonna get her thinking up though. Maybe. All right, um, she also needs to sell her paintings today. This is going to be an interesting one. Yep, this is going to be interesting. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, everyone's at school. Wait, you need to study hard. Let's see. Are either of them moving up a bit? They are not. Well, all right then. Okay, Willy Wonka is actually in really good shape, so we're going to have you come babble to the bear. Wake up and come babble to the bear. Uh, what was the last clingy one we had? The last clingy one we had was King Julian. Which makes sense, because that fits his character. Yay! Oh, no. 5333. Three. All right, um, 405, all right. Oh, oh, wait, why are we getting a phone call? Who's calling us? Oh. Okay, stock the table. Um, we're going to need to do a yard sale. Your nose has stopped up. Oh no, that's not good. Um, I've been doing a, I've been taking a lot of zinc and a lot of vitamin C, um, because we're in that time where like everything cha like, um, temperatures yo-yo a lot, so you're gonna get like stuffy because of it. Uh, your first kids' twins were clingy and fussy. Oh, Sabine, I am sorry. Uh, tend the table. Come on, tend the table. Finish your food and then tend the table. Yeah, do that. And hi, says people. How are you? How's your day going? I hope it's going fantastic. Yeah. Kenzie's cursed me with enough juju to where I'm used to it by now. Um, and says people, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lounge chair, and get comfy. Yeah. All right. Are you done? Uh, sure. Go for it. Someone, not me. All right. So we need to mark up prices 300% because we got to get our money's worth. We got to get our money's worth because we know what we're worth. Um, you're doing a hundred baby challenge using Rosalie from Twilight. That would be very interesting. That would be. Oh, wait. A thousand babies. Oof. She can do it, though. She would happily do that. Knowing the character. Yeah. 
I don't I wouldn't have the patience for for that many babies though I can barely handle a hundred before I'm like I gotta restart this all right let's see who's the coming so we got Luca pancakes then we got Cortez Chopra all right wait so we've got 159 351 312 405 and 325 all right oh wait we got another one Paola bear all right 1300 for our 400 one no 351 that's what okay okay one mo one more and we should be able to pay our bills one more and we should be able to pay our bills just gotta sell one more painting okay here comes our next um victim Gemma Richards and this is she bought before he even showed up Marcus Ito and who are you come back here who are you Tracy Chopra oh she bought our death painting all right well hey we can do that okay she's gone into labor so no more yard sale um clear table she went into labor so we can't do another one uh, but before we do that, could we, um, pay our bills, please? Yeah, we're gonna need to pay our bills. Hey, it's Aaron! Hi, Aaron! Aaron looks sad. And hi, Madeline, how are you? How's your day going? Are you still masterpieces on Plopsy? Ooh! That could be fun. Acquired the thinking skill. All right, well, um, <laughs> it's time to go have a baby. So, if we go now, then the, then the two kids will get sent to daycare. So, let's go have a baby. All right, we're going to start a prediction with if it is a boy or a girl. Go ahead and gamble your channel points away. Do we have room for triplets? I haven't checked. We'll have to check that once it loads. Um, You're good. Oh, that's good to hear. Um, Are we going to build or are you going to build? We are not building today. We are just doing the 100 baby challenge. So we're going to have a bunch of babies. Uh, but yeah, you're done with your homework. Nice. Nice. Congrats. Congrats. It's always a great feeling. Yep, if it's going to load. All right. So start thinking of um, baby names as well, guys. Um, and I hamki, uh, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, I think. Wait, let's try, um, <laughs> um, and the any key, welcome on in, welcome on in, I'm trying to check in, check in at front desk, there we go, go do that, uh, but welcome on in, how are you, how was stream, what did you get up to? All right, we are just, you're actually just in time because we're getting ready to have a baby. Chucky, we're about to have a baby, but I'll talk to you anyway. We're about to have your newest sibling. For those who don't know, Chucky is our oldest, who is a vampire, who, so that means he's still alive. Um, you left your hair in a piranha pond, or your air, your air in a piranha pond. Why did you send the the air to the piranhas? No talkie. Baby time. She ain't waiting for the doctor, guys. She's just going right in. She's going to deliver the baby herself. Wait, who's our doctor? <gasps> we got a live one, guys. We got a live one. Uh, it's pronounced like I am gay. It's your actual name, but it's fates would have it. You're actually gay. 
that is actually that is a fantastic story i love that for you but guys we actually have a living doctor that isn't married to one of our kids at least i don't think so we gotta check this out though because if so okay rian miyazaki We got, we have to make sure that he is not related to us in any way. So. We just got to make sure we don't have a Miyazaki in the family. All right. Doesn't matter about this. You are, nope. Wouldn't be a child. Okay. I don't want to say it too early. Oh! Hello, Bear. That's our grandchild that came to buy something from us. Okay, maybe. No! No! Ah! That's so frustrating. That's... We're going to go with the fact that he doesn't know. What That's what we're going to go with. He does not know that she's his great-grandmother. No, we're, That's what we're going to go with. Yeah. Hi, Stacey. And have a good one, Sarah. Have a good one. Um, So, we are on set three now, Stacey. And, um... Our doctor is our granddaughter's husband. At least I think it's granddaughter. We'll have to make sure granddaughter, not great granddaughter. But yeah, but he's related to us again. But, all right, we've had a girl. Which I didn't even check to see if the uh, prediction was done. I hope it was. It was, okay. So we have a girl. And then... We'll see. Um, and it's Risby. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right. I'm going to open it up for you guys to um, gamble on if you think it's twins or singles. And then I'm also going to open it up for the baby names. Now, remember, there's going to be three spots for it. So you're going to want to give me the character name plus the book that it is from. And remember... Um, no, where is it? No, Harry Potter, Divergent, Twilight, or Fifty Shades. So it's now open for you. Uh, welcome on in, Paul Witch. Welcome on in. And Abby, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. Also, Kenzie, if we could do a shout out for Stacy, please. Before Stacy yells at me and runs away. All right, so we have Alice from Go Ask Alice. All right, there's room for two more. For those who don't know, Stacy made our emotes that you guys love. All right, so we have... Ah, if I could type. All right, so we have room for two more. So just give me two more book characters, guys. Yep, there we go. There's there's two, three of them. And I think the other ones I have to do. Yes. These are all by the ever wonderful Stacy. Wow, I love them all. Oh, 
those are good ones. Those are good ones. All right. All right. And then I got to add this in so you guys can fight over them. All right. Submissions are closed. So we have Alice from Go Ask Alice. Anna from My Sister's Keeper. Or Hazel from The Fault in Our Stars. Oh, you're fine. So it has to be a book character. Um, and the only character, the only universes that are off limits are Harry Potter, Divergent, Twilight, and Fifty Shades of Grey. So, all right, go ahead and vote for which one you want to be the next baby name. Oh, wow. Y'all really going for it. Well, someone voted for yours, Kenzie. All right. Ooh. This might be closer than we thought. Um, and yes, yeah, so the to suggest a name, um, it they are five hundred it's five hundred channel points to where you suggest the name for it. Um, and I always um, we turn them, we close them so that way you don't, like, use them, um, when we're not taking a baby name so we don't lose your, uh, suggestion. Um, but I'll always let you guys know before it opens up. Oh, dang! We gotta run away! Okay. All right. Although the Percy Jackson books are really good. They are really, really good. Although, um, for his books, I would say that if Percy Jackson, like that whole universe. So I think there's like three different series that he's included in. That would all be one universe, but his Kane Chronicles would be a separate universe. If that makes sense. All right, we got Hazel. All right, let's see. Is it going to be a single, twins, or hold on. We have one. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Just one, please. 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 Yes! Yes, I win! I won! I just gave birth and you're texting me to tell me you have a crush on me. You gave me a kid. I don't need you anymore. Ghost him. <laughs> okay, but like Wanda decided she was going to age up. All right, you know, all right. I am to misbehave. And Super Bucko, thank you for that. Can we get all the love and hype in chat for a first time subscriber and with your Prime? You could have used your Prime anywhere, but thank you for deciding to use it here. All right, you have you have access to some of the funniest emotes. I'm gonna say yeah, I'm gonna say funniest emotes because now you get to pet a mod. You get to, um, well, they, they sip at me and then they, they cause chaos. So that's pretty much what they do. Actually, that's backwards. That's the combo. Uh, you have a great, yeah, there's 25, we've got 24 more kids to name for sure. Oh, thank you, Super Bucko. Thank you. It's very sweet of you. We try to have fun here. Yes, we try to have fun here. Now, oh, wait, baby. I remembered. Hi, Munchkin. Baby counter went up. And now we get to vote on a dad. Mwaha. All right, we got to put the, the birth certificate up. 
See, I remembered Kinsey without being told. All right, so let's go to the gallery. I'm doing good, Munchkin. I'm doing good. How are you doing? All right. We got a bunch. We got some that we got to go through. Maybe. Uh, Kenzie, are the new ones on the spreadsheet by chance? They are because Kenzie is awesome. Get all the, the mod love in chat because Kenzie is amazing and is like keeping the spreadsheet up to date for me. All right, so let's filter. All right, got to get rid of this. All right, so we got a couple of good ones. We got a couple of good ones. Um, did Georgina get vladded? That's a good question. I don't remember. I gotta look. No, she won her 50-50. She won her 50-50. All right, so the next dad, we have a couple of good options. So we have, let's see, um, oh, I scrolled too fast. My bad. Uh, we're going to go with Don Juan from Don Juan. We're going to go with, uh, who are you? Dimitri from the bloodlines which is a spin-off of vampire academy okay all right bloodlines there we go if i could spell that that would be wonderful um let's see what else, what other options do we have we have Simon Snow from a book called Carry On. Then we have... <laughs> we have Newt from The Maze Runner. And then, ooh, I'm, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna pit those two together in, in their own poll. Um, what about this? We'll go with, um, is it Basilton? From Carry On as well. All right, so we're going to have you guys vote on those. Um, yes, yes. So we do have one on there on the spreadsheet to where it'll say, like, um, survive 50, 50. I do need to go back through on the dad's tab and the length of time to die. I need to go back through the first set and figure all that out. Um, uh, so yeah. Um, let's see. All right. Thank you, Kenzie. Um, so as long as they're like no more than R rated. If they're like NC-17 or X, then no. Those wouldn't be allowed. Um, but if they're ba if they're R-rated, then yeah, that would be fine. Because I have to say, my favorite book series is rated R just because of the first book. And that's really about it. But I mean, it, you don't, it's, it's not your typical R-rated book. Um, and Raspberry Lemon, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Um, and it's really because, like, well, there's two things. There's a really graphic scene in, um, the first one. And then there's, like, descriptive, semi-descriptive sexy times later on. Like, scattered throughout the rest of the series. So, it's really, yeah... After the first book, it's not really rated R. 
they just slapped like that kind of that kind of rating on the book series just as a disclaimer overall all right who's the next dad all right so there was don juan dimitri simon snow newt or basilton basilton i don't know how to say his name if someone wants to tell me the name that'd be great um now you want to make a main character in a time travel book um yeah definitely if you guys want to make the um uh, make a dad there's all the information for it please feel free to make a dad for it um i it was on i don't think it was good it was i don't remember where i was reading but like there was a thing that that said that it's essentially like if it was a movie it would be rated r So, yeah. I've if if you'd like to know what the graphic scene is, I did put it in the um in the Discord under the um in the book nook. I did uh spoiler what the um what that scene is, what that what it is, so that way you you can be informed before you read it. Definitely don't read it if you're not able to handle that. If you are or if you're able to compartmentalize, great series. Um, did I download the update? Yes, I did. Uh, we have not really looked at it yet, though. All right, so, Kenzie, congratulations. Newt is now a part of our 100 Baby Challenge. Good luck to him. He cute, though. All right. Um, oh, she needs to go feed. And we need to kick Wanda out really quick. Because apparently, Wanda decided that she was going to be one of those. Blow out candles. Uh, you know what? We'll keep that down here. We'll keep that for somebody. I don't know what they'll use it for, but we'll keep it. Sell those. Just don't pass out before you're done. Blow your candles out. All right. Whee! All right, so Wanda is a hot-headed erratic sim who is also a music lover. All right, do we like this for her? Basilton, or Basilton. All right, we're going to look that up. I'm going to look that up because I'm going to learn how to say these character names. All right, do we like Music Lover for um, Wanda? I don't know anything about the character, so you guys are going to have to help me. But if we like this for Wanda, then I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one zero all right we'll lock it in all right add birthday candles i don't i think you're going to bolt no you're not going to boldy's house uh because boldy we moved in with ron so you're going to move in with king julian all right that's right yeah you're moving in with king julian great okay bye I did. Oh, I can't clean out your inventory again, but. All right. Okay, bye. She's going to pass out. Absorb. All right. No, you are not kicking a soccer ball. You need to do that. Ah, no, sir. <laughs> you need to leave. And then we need to go get pregnant. All right. Save and go to manage worlds. Oh, yeah. Mom's like, I just popped out a baby. I just did all the work. Now I'm just going to go play. Mm -hmm, yeah. Seems about right. Seems about right. Yep. We need a baby. We need more babies. Okay, interesting thing. The ones, these cans without the wraps, they stay colder longer. It's pretty interesting. 
All right. So. All right, Georgia. Get out. Georgina. You know, more dads. Oh. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, move into other households. We don't want that. I actually don't. Well, hold on. Enable for you. All right, you can get a dog or a cat, leave your career, retire, join a career. You can do all those. Vlad cannot, because we need complete control over Vlad. Yeah, all right. So, other households. Yep, they can do all that. That works. All right. Well, this is going to be very interesting now, guys. It's going to be very interesting to see what Sims is now doing versus what um, we've been doing with MC Command Center. So. All right. Move in, Newt. Okay. Time to go get pregnant. <laughs> She's literally in her hospital gown. I mean, yeah. She does, but hey, it works. Uh, you only use MCC to check pregnancies? Oh, I do it. I use it for everything. I use it for everything. Um, I actually have special settings that because anytime you have MC Command Center, um, any settings you make are gonna be across all your save files. So you have to, so if you're going to play separate save files, um, before you go into it, you need to make sure that like you have this, that version's um, set MC settings folder go in there. Um, so like the YouTube Elemental Legacy, um, Akira is going to be paying child support. Well, I can't make, I can't enable child support payments um, in the current state in that save file without a separate MC command center settings file. Because in the 100 baby, you can't get child support payments. Uh, pretty much super bucko, pretty much. They waited seven years to give a story progression, but. Oh, fine, I'll, are you, gonna, are you eating or cleaning up? No, put that down, I need the money. No, we're going to go travel. You can leave them all at home. The toddlers will go to daycare. It's fine. They'll learn a skill. Um, but the fact that they did give us a form of story progression, to me, it says that um, they're not, like, the game isn't going anywhere for a while. And maybe since now they're finally starting to listen to us, we'll actually get decent updates in the future instead of updates that are only bug updates. So like updates with actual new things to put life back into the game. So, yeah. Uh, you love snooping on Towny Sims to see who they're pregnant with? Oh yeah, 100%. If you have MC Command Center and you don't do that, sure you don't. The only people that don't do that are ones that don't know how to check pregnancy yet. But once you learn how to check pregnancy, as soon as you see a random townie that's pregnant, you're like, ooh, need to know. Or if you see Nancy Landgrab pregnant, then you're like, oh, um, need to fix. Oh, uh, you got every expansion? Nice, nice. Uh, do you have a favorite of them? 
All right, be buzzed in. Okay, go upstairs. All right, come here, Cole. Go away. All right, Chucky, I'm going to need you to leave too because this is awkward. All right, come here, Newt. Oh, hush. He's busy watching a clown on TV. All right, this is going to be interesting. All right, is this three click? It's not. All right. He's going to make us actually work for it. I mean, smart. Smart. But at the same time, I'm kind of annoyed. All right, pick up line. That should be enough. That is true. This is one of Kinsey's sims, so. Tease flirtatiously. And there goes the last exception. Good thing. We're not trying to give, we're not trying to get pregnant yet, so it, we might not have to um, double it. Don't you dare. Get back here and flirt with him. No eating for you. <laughs> Hi, Duck Duck. <laughs> Can we kiss him yet? <laughs> I just want a first kiss thank you oh my goodness uh seasons and cats or dogs okay okay oh no tony spirits fading away that's so sad all right smoochy smoochy okay you did the smoochy smoochy now baby Baby. Baby. No! Chucky! Get out of here! Go! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! No! 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 Leave! No! The only one that would have been worse would have been Cole. I do not need to woohoo in front of my son. No. 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 You weren't supposed to come back so fast. Well, okay. Yep. Yeah. Okay, come on, hurry up. Hurry up before another one, before oh, you guys come back, come on. Come on. Come on, pregnancy test. Pregnancy test, thank you. He was just standing there cheering us on and awkward. Of all the people. And we do it this way so that way she doesn't get slapped. All right, pregnant, 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 pregnant! All right. Let's find out what's his what's his opinion. Oh, he's excited. All right, hi Salty Bean, how are you? All right, guys. Oh wait, I didn't do that. My bad. All right, guys. That didn't, nah. There we go.
All right. It is time. It is time. And hi, Slowy. How are you? How is your day going? There we go. All right. Make sure you are getting your channel points in. All right. Do you think Newt is going to live or... Do you think he will be sent to Vlad? Not a problem, Stacy. Not a problem. Thank you for the lurk. All right. You have 30 seconds remaining to get your gambles in. Okay, so he has survived. He won his coin flip. All right, then. All right, then. Congratulations to Newt. Congratulations to Newt. Okie doke. Well, I'm going to have to give you your, your channel points to those who said lives. Okay. Two in a row. Two in a row. Definitely, definitely unexpected definitely unexpected all right well you lucked out this time buddy go home no food for no food for you go home <laughs> he just said rude y'all heard that right he just said rude okay I, i'm okay with him living now i'm okay with him living now and also that is how we know that was kenzie's sim that is how we know it was Kenzie's sim. Yep. Wow. Just, just, yeah. Okay. All right. All right. That works. That, that works. Okie dokie. All right, if it's going to load. Yes, no, maybe. All right. All right, so I am actually going to take a quick eye break to put some eye drops in and such. So I'm going to put you on words on stream. So that'll give me just a moment. All right, let me... Get the words on stream going for you. 
There we go. All right. So. And thank you for reminding me to take a drink. Yes. All right. So go ahead and I will set you on words on stream while I go and do my eye drops. And I'll leave you with some good music. And have fun. I will be right back. Okay.
All right, how we doing, how we doing? Yeah, I'm not sure how much I can help with this one. Yeah, I'm not sure how much I can help with this one. Um... Uh, my only thing was hover, but that's apparently a fake letter. All right, so apparently I'm no use with this. All right. But I mean, y'all knock this one. Uh, well, dang. Well, dang, guys. Um. All right. Okay, I'm trying to think what this last one could be. Veep. Is veep, veep's a word? What does veep mean? We must look this up, veep. Oh, it's a TV show, apparently. Um. Also means vice president. All right. All right. All right. I mean, okay, we'll take it. We'll take it. All right, do you guys want to do one more? Or do you want to pop back into the game? It's up to you guys. We can do one more. We can go ahead and pop back into the game.
Back in and back in the game, do you want to do another round? All right. Let me swap these out. Back to the game. All right, we can do that. I will pause that for if I have to take another eye break then. All right. Okie doke. So we are now pregnant, which is good. Um, yes, we do have mail. I don't think we're going to have any gifts. We might. I don't think we will. Okay. Immediately go and sell. Yep, so sell all. Okay, that puts us back into our comfort range. Okie doke. So, let us go and... Oh, she needs to eat. We need to check on the toddlers, on like the food situation. <laughs> There's no food! Oh no! Hi, Betty! How are you, my dear? How's your day going? We have no food. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. She needs to go make food. Yeah, she needs to go make some food. Yeah. All right. Oh, you're doing good. That's good. I've been sucked back into the world of Vampire Diaries. Ian. I actually have not gotten sucked into that yet. I figure it's only a matter of time. But, uh, wait. What do our kids need? Thinking. Oh, you can come do your thinking. Everything. All right. Go do that. Um... Uh, you spent the past couple of hours making Hope Michaels and The Sims. Nice, nice. Um, then I, I think you'll enjoy this. Um, our matriarch's end game is Cole Michelson, who was also our, our first dad. So, yeah. That's who she's going to end up with in the final. Yep, and they already have a son together, Chucky Finster. All right, uh, if you could, like, finish the food, that'd be great, because um, kids got to eat. So, bathroom. Wait, why didn't you age up? You just didn't get there in time. All right, well, not much we can do in the moment other than just have him, like, do his homework. All right, oh, we got to give the toddlers some food just to keep them alive. Uh, I'm going to get rid of that because I don't know how much is left in that. Uh, put that there. And then I think when you're done. Yeah, when you're done, come over here and potty train. Fantikiro. Yes, because she just hit level three. Yes. All right. You put a picture in her Discord. I will definitely check that out. You are really good at making Sims. Oh, and she's absolutely filthy. Of course she is. Of course she is. All right. Potty time. No! We can't catch a break. All right, guys. Marceline passed, which means Marceline was I am pretty sure unless we missed one, unless like Regina or Eloise is alive, which I don't think they are. I think they've all passed. Um, all of our set one babies have since passed on that um, apart from Chucky. Yep. Apart from Chucky. That's very sad. 
Marceline, um, she passed away. She was the last kid of set one. She was Harold Saxon's child and was from Adventure Time. It's very sad, very sad. Uh, where are my showers from? So these are spa day. These are spa day showers. Um, the reason why I like the spa day showers is because they can be freestanding because these are frosted glass. So um, there can be other sims in the room and they don't have to be in their own little rooms. They're so helpful with the, this with this challenge. So helpful. All right, then potty train Fantagiro once you're done. Ugh. Fine, go to sleep. No napping on the bear chair. Go to sleep. All right, we might get a little bit of a break. We might get a little bit of a break. Yeah, we might. We'll see. Because these are all the kids she's had. So we might get a short break in between the sets. Um, but we'll have to find out. So. All right. Oh, Fantagiro's level two. Yes. Yes, you're level two. Great. She learns fast. I'll give her that. She learns fast. Okay, Gru's almost done. Gru's very sad. Of course you are. Of course you are, Gru. All right, I will let you just go back to sleep. Once you're done with that, go to sleep. Because there's not, yeah, like I said, there's not really much for Gru to do. Because you don't have extra credit because you're a, um... A C student. All right, so Fantagiro, you are our main girl right now. Actually, no, Hazel is also. Uh, so the infant is a girl, and we have a toddler that's a girl. Everyone else is a boy. All right, come on now. Get your potty up. Go eat. And then back to pottying you go. All right, clean all of these. Is there a reason you... Oh, she's going to meet her sibling. And she's mad about it, I'm betting. Yep, she's mad about her sibling. Oh, wait, we did have food. Not me just now seeing that there was also food in the baby thing. You know what? It's okay. We have food, though. We, we have more than enough food. Okay, so we're going to put mom to s wait. No. Super efficient baby care and then sleep. Because we're going to do this smart. And then we'll continue painting. Because we got to make more money. This is going to be very tight until we start making decent money off paintings. Yep. All right, where are you going to sit? Oh, you're just going on the couch. That's not nearly far enough. We may not even need the slide, guys. With the amount of running back and forth we've been having them do, we may not even need the slide. That'd be kind of cool, though. All right. I do want to send them out here to play in the sand. At some point. And then also we have this right here for logic and all those other fun things. So. All right. Well, let's, let's fast forward. This looks like everyone's just going to sleep. Yeah, everyone's going to sleep. You, yeah, everyone's sleep. Fast forward. Who's going to wake up first? Uh, it's no one's birthday today. Okay. Um, ooh, well, this will be interesting between Gru or Ariana. Who is going to wake up first? Ariana will. She's moving, even though she, she had a lot more to go, uh, she's just moving. Her needs are moving faster. All right. Uh, the new scenario, no skills, no problem. It's tough because all the normal ways of making money are not as profitable. Wait, really? 
Well, that sounds interesting. We may have to try that at some point. We may have to try that. Someone's outside grilling. That smells amazing. All right. Toddlers are sleeping and are hungry. Gru's hungry. So we'll let Gru get some food before Gru goes to school. Yeah, everyone's sad. It is what it is. Sorry, Gru. Okay, finish your food, please. Finish. Because I need you to go paint. Please. Yay! Painting time. All right. Let's have her do an impressionism painting. Um, Let's see. What do we have in our inventory here? We have three paintings. 405, 159, and 351. All right. Okay. That's not bad. Go paint. Poor Gru's not going to get to eat before school. You know what? I don't care. We're, we're not going to send Gru to school hungry two days in a row. Yeah. We'll, we'll do it once or twice. We'll try not to do it every day. I'm not that mean. But um, you are going to need to go to school, though. No cleanup. I will clean up. Go to school. Put put it down. Put that down. Put. Gru, put that down. Thank you. Go to school. I want the 100 simoleons I could have gotten out of that. All right. Fantagiro. How are you doing on your sleep? You are good enough. You are good enough. So I'm going to potty train you or potty chain you. Until you complete your potty. Because that's pretty much the only thing you have to do. Oh, painting level six. Nice. 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 Why are you getting a phone call? Oh, it's Benji! How did you know that? How does Benji seem to know all these things? I'm a little bit concerned. Just just a little bit concerned. Um, it's not 100 maybe unless everyone is sad. Yes. Um, the famous pod gets rid of sad moodlets. Wait, really? I must investigate. I've always ignored those pods. Um, okay, so it says... Gives you everything you need for a good night's sleep. Wake up inspired or energized or with someone else. Only if you entered with them. Okay. I've never actually used one of these beds before. I will have to try it out. That's pretty cool. Not gonna lie, that's pretty dang cool. Yeah, they just never interested me. So I just kind of always ignored their existence. It's pretty cool. How you doing, my dirty little kiddo? Geek Con, that's great. Oh, she's going to take care of the baby after she's done with that. All right, come on, Fantagiro. All right, we got mail. Don't care about that, though. Oh, uh, let it go. Uh, No, Chucky. Sorry, we're not going over to your house just yet. Sorry. I got a toddler to age up. Come on. We can do it. 45. 46. 47. Come on. 
And I got my other toddler. I'm very hungry. Blah, blah, blah. It's okay. Grab a serving. Keep your hairnet on. You'll be fine. I actually have food for you. All right, so how'd you do on this one? What, what is, what is that? It took you all that time to paint that. All right. Well, I don't need you for anything right now, so I'm gonna have you sell your things. <laughs> and it's raining, of course it is. All right, it's fine. Um, prices are at 300. Go ahead, yard sale. In the meantime, we have a toddler that is rapidly developing a diaper rash. And we're not even gonna talk about the fact that there's liquid that's made its way underneath the chair. Nope, we're just gonna ignore that fact. Just gonna ignore that. Um, XP Pen replied your tweet sent you a DM said happy birthday, replied nothing else since. Am doing a worry? Wait, confusion. Wait, is today your birthday? Hold up, did I not know this? I thought you already had... Confusion. Much confusion. I thought your birthday was the other day. Not the other day, like last month or something like that. And much confusion. Have, oh, happy Monday. Oh, okay. I was going to say, um, confusion. So much confusion. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. I was going to say, I knew you had one recently. But I wasn't for sure. All right. Okay. All right. So, okay. Now I'm confused about the XP pin. Who's XP pin? And, and I, I feel like I should know who that is. But I don't. Go potty again. Thank you. No, you don't get a bath. Not right now, at least. Uh, you haven't even gotten a skill up to level three. You don't deserve a bath until you get at least one skill up. I'm being nice-ish. Um, there's a potential funky new drawing tablet. Ooh. That sounds fun. That sounds fun. Are you almost done? Come on now, toddler. Wait, you look familiar. I feel like I know who you are. Clementine. No, that's not our Clementine. Caitlin Morales, that's a, um, grandchild. Had to think about it. Kenzie over here calling me out like that. All right, we got what? How long do we have left? 42 minutes. Buy a painting. Buy one of my paintings. Potty level three. Nice. Wait. They literally are not buying my large classic painting. All right. Okay, he got to his level three. Great. Great. Did you get to your movement level three? I don't know if you did. I didn't look. Not yet. 99. Grades are up. You're a B student. Great. Um. Wait. Hello. Go sit here. 
Nobody wants to buy this large classic painting and I'm kind of sad by this. Not a single person. But, on the other hand, we did just get our toddler's skill up to where she can age up, I think. Please tell me you got to level three. How are you not to level three movement? No, don't sit. Go here. You're... You are literally sitting... There we go. Okay. Hmm. These toddlers are stressing me out, guys. These tod... Oh, no. Who died? Someone else died. I don't know who died. Before she do... Before you do that, who died? Hiccup is an elder. All right. I don't see anyone on here that we missed. So it's probably a grandkid. Someone close, yeah. That was a grandkid. All right. Oh, this is getting so stressful. Don't like it. Don't like it at all. Nope. Yeah, definitely, Stacy. Fingers crossed that they're not trolling you. All right. So, are y'all going to be nice to me? Santa Giro is going to be... Proper. I don't know if that's good or bad, but we'll see. All right. And your thing is... Oh, come on. Thank you. Randomizer out of four. Ooh, creative. All right. Do we like it? Yes, no. Uh, well, you go get some food. Yes, Betty, please take care of yourself. The name is very difficult. I keep messing up the name, I think. I feel like I am. And it's making me a little self-conscious. So, I don't know. We're going to go with maybe. All right, if we like it, I am going to lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, lock it in. Oh, she cute. All right, put that back in the fridge. So, I'm going to assign you to... Oh, this is a pretty one. Assign that bed to you. Santikiro. Um, and then... Oh, you're already getting food. That works. Um, it's... F-A-N-T-A-G-H-I-R-O with a backwards tilde. It's Italian. That's a lot. Uh, no, Gru, put that down. Gru, put that down. Put that down. Wait, where are you going? No, eat your food. Oh my gosh. Wait, what are you scared of? You went outside in a thunderstorm. Of course you're scared of it. Play doctor. I, I don't even know. Oh, you sneaky little thing. All right. I will allow it. I will allow it. The toddler snuck a bath in on me. All right. All right. You win this round. You win this one. Mm-mm. All right, well, you did, wait, so you did your homework. No, you didn't do your homework. So do your homework after this. And then you're good. Um, Willy Wonka, since you have mom's attention, potty help. Ooh, you need, you need a shower, like, really bad. And to sleep and some fun. 
All right. I'm going to have you play Party Frenzy, and then I'm going to send you to sleep. That'll work. And then we're going to have Gru get a sandwich. Shower and then sleep. All right. So see, we're doing good or better. Oh, wait. No, before you sleep, we're going to have you mop. Yeah, that works. Uh, you love the video game thing. Yeah, the video game thing is really, really good of getting their fun up fast. Um... The video game mat is the best. Uh, I just don't have room for it. So, we do without. And mom is hungry. Of course she is. Uh, sure. You can give my number out. I can't guarantee that I will talk to the person, but you can give my number out. That works. That works. All right, motor level two. Fantastic. I just need your fun to get up into the green. Yep, go to bed. Before you pass out on me. Is that Littlefoot by chance? Is it Littlefoot? No, it's Sid. All right, invite in. Why is Voldemort texting us a congrats on our birthday? That's creepy. That's so creepy. So creepy. Voldy, no. Go, go terrorize Ronald. Yeah, yeah, go go terrorize Ronald. Oh shoot, I hit the wrong button. I hate when I do that. I was trying to save this. There we go. All right. Whip. Wait, we got a pizza? Please tell me it's not spoiled. It's not spoiled. Oh, that's a great, great. Um, yeah, that's a, that's a great gift. Yeah, come get some food, pizza. I would not say no to a pizza. What the heck? 10 out of 10, great gift. You're an elder. I'm not going to talk to you. Sorry. Nope. We got too many situations where elders are dying on us too quick. So no. Wait, are you level 2 by chance? Oh, you're so close. You're so close. All right, slide a bit. Your Hunter Baby House is all one floor. I used to do all one floor. Oh, is it, is it on Steam? I saw that you had tweeted about it, um, but I wasn't sure. Like, I didn't see what, um, what platform it was on. Oh, Stacy, you've done it now. You've done it now. Um, I have a version that I got from uh, someone's Discord over a year and a half ago, but I haven't ever installed it, so. I spent years, I lost my Sims 3 disc. All right, no, don't, no. Uh, potty train Willy Wonka. Willy Wonka, you can do that later. No, stop. Stop, get down. Get down. Potty train first. Then you can go do other things. 
Um, base game is under 10 pound. I may go ahead and re-get the base game just to have it. Cause I haven't, I haven't played it in a long time. I barely remember Sims 3. I remember I terrorized the land grabs a lot, but that was about it. I was actually really mean to the land grabs. At least in this version, I just steal her kids. Oh, uh, you did it off a of floor plan. Oh, nice, nice. Um, I'll take floor plans and that's what most of my speed builds are is I see a, I see a floor plan and I'm like I'm gonna try to recreate it and then I get bored with the floor plan about halfway through and then I'm like you know what I'm just gonna do my own thing Story of my life with building Which I'm sitting on two speed builds that I need to finish for you guys Because I want to upload them And then Kenzie gave me another one that I need to do. So, yeah. Lot. Now you want to buy Sims 3 and you're supposed to be saving money? I mean... Can you be mad about it, though? Can you be mad about it? Uh, 6650 for all the Sims 3 is such a good deal. I mean, imagine... Wait, how many packs were with... How many DLCs were with the Sims 3? I don't remember. Uh, polished perfection on all of those. Wait, no. No. You go to sleep. You have a, you have a child that can do that. Who is doing it for us. Nice. Um, I think both of them did. I told both of them to. I haven't checked to see if they did. She did not. So she needs to do her, do her homework and take a shower. All right. You are hungry. Of course you are. Um, eat the grape. And then eat the grape. That should keep you alive while you sleep. Yeah, go to sleep now. That works. You started thinking. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. All right, you are all set. You'll be all set. Are you crying in the bed? No crying in the bed. You, I, I've got so many other things that you could do. None of that. None of that. All right, you go do this. How much food is left? I, he's just talkative today. I'm sorry, guys. I. Outside, please. Thank you. All right, take a slice of pizza. And thank you for inviting me to take a drink. Oh, I'm gonna need to get a new drink soon. All right. Oh, and then the baby's upset. Do that and then pizza. Yum! All right, you are going to sleep. You've woken up. Okay, and then food. Uh, let's see. So, um, we probably should... Probably should upgrade all the beds today. Because we know this one's upgraded, so we need to upgrade these two. Plus all of these. Plus, then we need to upgrade all the toilets and the showers and the sinks. And possibly computers? We'll see. We'll see. The good part, though, is that they've all done their homework now. Or they should have. No, you didn't. Well. Oh, and I forgot I have a toilet right here. 
All right. Okay, go do all that. Finish your food. Finish your food. All right. Do your homework. And then I got to figure out a way for you to have fun. Oh, wait. You can play doctor and have fun doing that. All right. Problem solved. All right. So... How hungry? That's not filling mom up very much. The pizza is not. So I guess the pizza in this game is considered like a snack. But like a slice of pizza is not a snack. It depends on how big you slice the pizza. Like if you get a piece of pizza from like Costco or Sam's, that's like half the size of your head. If not the entire size of your head. But, like, yeah, if you get a, a small pizza, then, yeah, it's going to be kind of smaller. Or if you do, like, the square cut pieces, then, yeah, you're going to have to have multiples of those. But otherwise, nah. Oh, good. She's having fun with her, with her handiness. That's cute. Oh, she's not going to get to have fun before school. That's fine. Sad, but that's fine. All right, finish that and go to school. Both of you finish your homework. Yes, go to school. She ate Little Caesars. Honestly, I don't know anybody that's satisfied after eating Little Caesars. They're always like slightly unsatisfied, either because it's so greasy or because it just wasn't filling. One or the other. Uh, thanks to you, I cheat so you can just boot the sad mood that's out. I typically don't. I typically leave those in because it adds more spice to the game. It's frustrating, but I, it still adds spice to the game. All right. Both of you are at school. Oh. Oh, child. Wake up and go get food. Go get your food. This is not good, not good, not good. Not good at all. Go, yeah, get get some food in you. Sit down and, and eat, please. I'm begging you, please get some food. She's been needing to take a shower a lot in this place. I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, she's eating, so, like, it's not terrible. Oh, you can go potty now. Why are you talking to her? Go potty. I forgot. Yeah, you can go potty now. The only thing we need mom for eventually, possibly, is thinking. So, yeah, go do that. Go potty. And then... Imagination. All right, and mom's getting a call. If my kid throws up in the hallway, then take care of my kid. Don't just call and, and like, tell me. What the heck? Uh, by the 20th kid, you just have to accept the fact they'll be eternally depressed. So it wasn't until we were on, like, 28, 29 that my kid started passing away. Uh, that's because my first kid was a vampire. So we got a little bit of extra time. And I had a lot of twins and triplets in the first set. Between the first set and the early second set. We haven't really had many later on. So I don't know if maybe it was a glitch in my settings or something. That was causing them to appear so much. Yeah. It's just a bit odd. Alright, now get back inside. It's raining. Get back inside. There's plenty for you to do in here. Um, let's see. Yeah, we're going to have you come meditate. Yeah, we're going to have you come meditate. Because your um, meditation, your wellness skill is abysmal. And also, if we get it to, I think it's level six, she learns a new recipe. 
for a superfood salad. I think it's level six. Yeah. It's just a glitch. It's just how they set up the relationships, really. So, it, I mean, it's one of those it is what it is, as annoying as it is type things. All right, mom's doing that. The kids are at school. Oh, wait, we didn't have them study hard. Son of a biscuit. All right, that's fine. That's fine. All right. Do your thing. Child, we are trying to get our skills up. All right. Yeah, that's great. We can't do 90% of that because we're pregnant. All right. Wait, Thanos died? I thought Thanos was a vampire. Hold up. Was Thanos not a vampire? Huh. Well, let, let me save and I'll note down the time and I'll have to go back in and, um, and look. All right. Uh, Pine Crossing, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. All right. I mean, I'm not mad Thanos died. That means Thanos is out of my game again. So... And hi, Pine Crossing. How are you? How is your day going? Jake's going to be very mad. And I love it. Zeminia, go away. No. I don't want your job. All right. All right. And it's Hazel's birthday. Of course it is. And I still have a toddler. All right, you know what? All right. Actually, since mom's not doing anything at the moment... Teach basic needs. Get... Okay, grew as a bee... Fantagiro is now a B student. All right, let me guess. Gru would have been an A student if I had, yeah, if I had studied hard, he would have been an A student. Son of a biscuit! All right, it's fine. It's fine. Just means they're in the house longer. I just want this whole set out of my house so I can start fresh with the books, kids. And they're not leaving my house. Sag. Uh, yeah, so we've been using the play tent. Um, we used the play tent in the Willow Creek and the um, Sulani home. Um, I decided I wanted I wanted something different. I didn't want to do the same thing over and over each house. So each house's play sets and toddler areas are set up slightly differently. So that way we kind of experience the whole, like all aspects of the game. But no, I'm I'm doing good, Pine Crossing. I'm doing good stressful this 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 one this house is stressing me out because i made it harder for myself now i'm regretting it yep definitely regretting it definitely regretting it all right um oh your mental skill you need to get your mental skill up kiddo Yes, you can like video gaming. That's fine. We just got stuff to do. All right, come on, get your... Nope. Nope, you're gonna basic needs. Nope, put that, put, put the child down. Put him down, thank you. Where are you going? Don't you be going upstairs. Don't you. Happy. 
Where are you going? Why are you all the way over here? What was the point of that? What, what, what was the point of that? There was no point. All right, that was, there was zero point to that. What the heck? No, 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 no. That was ridiculous. Oh, oop, we got, we got, we got toilet need. Go to the bathroom. You got to level two, right? Yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. All right, then you can come back and play. Gru also needs to use the toilet. All right, Gru, go use the bathroom once you're done with your game. And then go eat. Wait, how much salad do we have left? Oh, we're good. We're good. She can make another salad after this. She'd be like, but first, let me take a selfie. Yes. Yes. All right, motor level three. I don't care about that. I need thinking level three. Oh, he's not in good shape. All right, come on, please. You're only at 74%. All right. Go to sleep then. Sure, sure. Talk to Aaron. Sure, why not? Why not? It'll get you out of the kiddo's hair. I know, she was mad at me for not letting her pick the kid up, but like... Sims. No. Oh, you're gonna have an accident if you don't go to the bathroom now. Please do that. All right, I want you to get to level three, if possible. Welcome back, Munchkin. Welcome back. Yeah, they get they gain their skill faster if they're in a good mood. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Now who's calling? Oh. Okay. Now here is one that. Is tell basically telling us that they're moving on from us. I feel like we need to encourage this. I feel like this needs to be encouraged. So, yeah, we're going to go for it. Tell him to go for it. Yep. All right. Eat your pizza. Eat your pizza, and then, actually, what are your, all your skill levels at? So, writing's at almost 8%, 8, not 8%, level 8, so we do need to get writing up. I do kind of want to finish the gardening. Um, I think we may just have her go harvest stuff to get the gardening up, but we'll see. Um, and Ciara, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. You've been brainstorming potential dads and forgot to unlark. You are totally fine. You are totally fine. We have plenty of time so you guys can make dads for quite a while before we'll move on to the next set. Uh, let's see. Painting's level six. Fitness is level seven, shockingly. Actually, hold on. Can she go bike riding by chance? I wonder. Can she go bike riding? She can. Even while pregnant, she can go bike riding. Okay. I didn't realize that was a thing that she could do. Did Aaron just walk in from the back door and then go to the front door to knock? I think he did. Alex, we don't have money. Huh, interestingly, we can. So that'll be how she'll get her fitness skill up. Basically, by the end of this, I want her to have maxed almost, like, as many skills as she possibly can. Just through the course of her life and not, like, trying to, like, force skills. 
Actually, honestly, if we could have all 100 kids by the time she is a young adult, not young, by the time she is an adult, that would be awesome. Because then she could have her whole adult life to go do whatever she wanted. Yep, uh, that's the plan. That's the plan. Because her birthday is still... Yeah, it's over a week out, so we theoretically could. Because she's how many days? How many days does she? Ten. All right, so maybe. It's a maybe. Definite maybe. Depends on how many twins or triplets we have. Yeah. Yeah. So now, guys, when we do when we do run four, um, we are not going to worry about age. We're just gonna play it out and see how it goes. Um, I may even do what Taz did and set um, it to where you still age while pregnant. I might do that. Um, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Because once I complete this run, then I've pretty much, like, pushed it as far as I can. Especially if we finish this with all of... The, while she's still a young adult. So, I mean, we'll see. Uh, but yeah, so for those that don't know, once we finish this run, uh, we'll be doing a Harry Potter 100 baby. Um, which is going to be very spellcastery. Uh, similar to how we set this up, um, we'll probably have a good month to two months of nothing but building for that save file. Um, because everything is going to be very spellcaster-y. Um, and things like that. So we'll have a lot of building for it. Um, so yeah, that, that'll be fun. And I, yes, I will be using a lot of mods for it. So, um, cause I know that there's a couple of mods for spellcaster, like enhancements. We're going to be doing that. Cause I just think it'll be fun. And also cause I've never like truly fully explored the realm of magic pack. And yes, we do a little bit with the, um, do wait, do we do it with the elemental legacy? I don't think we actually have anything in the elemental for that. Um, and Ragey Races, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch chair, and get comfy. No, we didn't do anything with Realm of Magic. The only occult we had was vampires, because we needed that for dark. So, yeah, so we haven't really done anything for Realm of Magic. So that one will be a full exploring Realm of Magic. So then when we move to Glimmerbrook for set four... Um, then that'll be our sneak peek into what it'll be like. Because we're going to live in that one. We're going to stay in Glimmerbrook for, like, most of the time. So, all right. Okay, get some sleep and then get some... Wait, I need to tell you to sleep. Otherwise, you'll get up. Just blow. All right, food. Grab a serving. You need to sleep. Go to sleep. I can't send you to bed. Actually, I'm going to have to make you nap. Because you're not going to make food while you're that tired. 391, that's it. Rude. All right, actually, I'm going to have you wake up and do that and then go back to sleep. Just so you are decent. Like, you're able to, like, function. Alright, so. Salads. Let me make a salad. Are you gonna bring up the things? Thank you. Garden salad, here we go. Oh, 
All right. Yeah, you're good enough on sleep. All right. Everyone else is, yeah, doing good on sleep. Okay. All right. Come on, toddler. Finish up and go back to bed. Because your sleep is, you need to sleep. Especially because mom's going to be going to sleep. Wait, no, you didn't finish that. Come back here and finish that. Finish. No, get your patootie back there and... Go eat that. I don't see the purpose in that. Other than getting like 2% movement skill out of that. That was a waste of time. All right. I think we're good on needs. Yes. All right. Then mom's going to eat that and then I'll put mom to sleep. After we super efficient baby care. Yeah, so, all right. And shower. You need food and, and all that stuff. All right. I think you all have slept enough now. Let's get, let's get you, let's get you all taken care of. All right. Yeah, put that down so I can do that. Thank you. Then go to sleep. All right, who's going to finish with their needs first? Uh, maybe you. All right, so let's get them ready for school. You didn't do your skill. That's what I figured. All right. I figured you wouldn't because your needs were terrible. All right. Gru, come on now. Yeah. It doesn't really matter if Gru does his homework or not. As long as he study hard, studies hard. Where are you going? No! Go to sleep! Toddler, go sleep! Oh my goodness. I do not like this. Oh wait, no. Oh wait, host guided meditation? Wait, no, go to sleep. Yes, go go to sleep. I didn't mean to do that. We might have to try that somewhere. We might definitely have to try that. All right. Come on, finish up, please. Y'all's needs were terrible. And you have to pee as well. Of course you do. Of course you do. All right. No skill for you today. It just means she won't age up to an A student. She'll just get her performance bar up, which is fine. Hi, Ronald. I'm glad you're still alive and Voldy hasn't killed you yet. Wait, who do we have a sentiment with? We have a sentiment with Sid. What's our sentiment? A jamtastic gift. That was a terrible pun. That was a terrible pun. All right. Go do something else, please. Please. Go meditate. Thank you. Pantagiro is going to school. Gru taking his sweet time. That works. Totally something you would say. Wait, which thing? Which thing? Oh, wait. Study hard. The pun. Okay. Oh, Groove. Honey. Why are you standing there? Go to school. 
go to school. I should have sent him without doing his homework. He's not going to age up now. Nope, no love day for you. Kylie Martin. Who is Kylie Martin? Kylie Martin has to be another grandkid. Why is it telling me that grandkids have passed away? I don't care if a grandchild has passed away. Kylie Martin, granddaughter. Whose kid was she? Elijah's kid. Oh, that's kid number two. All right. Wait, how many kids did Elijah have? Elijah had four kids? No. He had three kids. Well, dang, Elijah getting busy on us. Out of curiosity, though. Aminadil didn't have any kids. Chandler had two kids. What about Buffy? Buffy had one kid who's actually still alive? All right. What about number five? Number five had two kids. All right. All right. At some point, like, I need to sit down and write down all the kids that they had. At some point. Uh, your mom keeps trying to get you to wear jeans. I live in jeans. I wear jeans for literally everything. I'll even sleep in jeans. To me, jeans are the most comfortable thing in the world to wear. Yep, uh, you'll, you'll, I'll wear jeans pretty much for everything. Why am I being flipped? Is it because of my love for jeans? If so, rude. Very rude. I don't know. I just, I've always found jeans super comfy. Okie doke. Um, how is, how is your skill going, by the way? Meh, it's going meh. Yes, all of them are studying hard. They should be. I told them to. Yeah, study hard. Study hard. He won't, I doubt he'll age up because he was so late to school. But we'll see. You live in sweats or pajama pants? See, I can't wear pajama pants. They just, it feels weird to me. Like, I'll wear them to bed, but that's about it. Like, this weekend I tried walking around with... Oh, hey, Fat Amy wants to come over. Wait. Fat Amy is an elder. Hold on. No, okay, she's safe. I was going to say, I'm not going to have you come over just to die on my lot. How many days do you have left? 11 days. Okay, you're fine. I'm not having them pull a Leo on me. Nope. Nope, we're not doing that. Not today. All right. What do we have to do today? Not much. Sell stuff. Which, oh, we got to check the mail. Oh, nothing in the mailbox. All right, open seed packet. Open seed packet again. All right, so let's see. I'm going to guess 2,700. Nope, not the bike. I need the bike. All right, I need these. Anything else? No. No. Oh, I was, I was off even by that. It was only 2.2. All right. Fine. Fine. All right. I mean, fair. Willy Wonka, you could use more sleep. 
So we're just gonna let Willy Wonka sleep. What are you what are you working on? You are working on video gaming. You know what? No. If you're gonna just be hanging around and chilling. Painting! We need more money. <laughs> we desperately need more money. Desperately. All right. Come on. Give me a nice painting. Give me a nice painting. Actually, what do you do? Is that the dog can stacked? That's the dog can stacked on top of each other. All right. As long as it's a high quality painting and I get a lot of money for it, I'm okay with it. Come on. And Mrs. Kitty, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, come on. Come on. Give me a good painting. Give me a good painting. And also, uh, if you would not mind getting me to 50%. Hey, so just eat it. Oh, no. And Brad of Alton, welcome on in. How are you? How are you? How are you? All right. Tazel has aged up. Charmer. All right. What do we think? What do we think? And hi, Mrs. Kitty. How are you? How's your day going? And how's your day going, Brian Velton? I hope it's going fantastic. Thank you for coming on over. All right. If we like uh, Kenzie. My stream is going good, but Kenzie is trolling me. Independence. All right. Do we like it? So we'll lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ah, Kinsey! Wild. Have they fixed weddings? Um, in the patch that they just did, they only fixed um the clothing bug. They didn't see doesn't seem like they fixed anything else yet. Um, however, I did go back and reread the laundry list, and they said that there was going to be two patches before the big patch that fixed all the bugs. So my guess is they're gonna be um they released one fix. And then they'll release in the next patch. They'll release more fixes. And and then they'll see what still needs to be fixed after that. All right. The next one. Independence. All right. Do we like it? If so, in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right. Lock it in. Wait, she's like white blonde. Cool. I don't think we've had that color before. All right, Hazel is is so relatable. The very first thing that she went for when she aged up and could eat normal food was pizza. That's fantastic. Gotta love it. Uh, but yes, overall, uh, Brian Belton, the stream is going well. We've had, we've had one kid, um, we've kicked a kid out. She should be going into labor semi soon. I don't know. I missed, hang on. Did Gru age up? I don't think Gru did. No, Gru didn't do anything. Yeah. So both of them are going to age up at the same time. Mrs. Kitty, thank you for that. First, can we get all the love and hype and chat for a first time subscriber as well as with your prime? Thank you for that. That is very sweet of you. She got independent, Kenzie. And thank you, sus people. Thank you. I try to make stream fun and entertaining as best I can. Then weird stuff happens and then I'm just like, I don't even know. I don't even know. Um... 
You know what? If you're independent, I'm gonna have you go potty and max that skill out. Okay, thanks. Yeah, go max that skill out. Thank you. Oh, uh, you need a bath, but actually come here. Go here. We're gonna have mom. Where is mom? Mom's randomly standing in a bathroom. All right, go mom. Wait, no, don't bike here. How are you biking? Oh, because I put it... Go here. Because I put the bike in her inventory, apparently. Nah, you don't get to keep the bike. No, do not take the bike out in the... <gasps> no! Who died? Who died? No, Hiccup died! No! Not my baby Hiccup! This is so sad! F's for Hiccup! Um... And Lilima, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. You love this challenge? I'm glad you do. I'm glad you do. And Sam, oh no. Are you in trouble? I hope you're not in trouble. Or do you just have to work over then? Bellabot, read the room. That is the second bath Willy Wonka has snuck in on me. All right, give it to you. Mm -mm. All right. Bellabot did. Bellabot was just like, rip, I'm done. Yeah, all right, whatever. You do your thing, Bellabot. Gru, you okay, bud? I don't know what's wrong with Gru. Something's wrong with Gru. Alright, actually, the kids don't really need much. Can you wash your hands and I'll have you do your homework? Thank you. Uh, do your homework first and then you can eat. Do y'all not want your salads anymore? Like, what gives? What gives? Then bathroom. Potty time. There we go. Yes, we have not saved in a while. Yes, save. Especially because we just lost two more kids. Uh, you yeeted out of work and now you're a burrito? Mmm, burritos. Jeremy kids getting you sick? That is fair. That is fair. Jeremy kids do get other people sick. Mm-hmm. Yep, it happens. All right. You go eat, you go do your things. What are you doing? Cleaning. Of course you are. All right, well, Mom, since the kids are eating and doing stuff on their own without you, we don't need you. Go to sleep. Actually, hold on. She's going to give birth soon, right? Yeah, she's going to give birth soon. All right. All right. There we go. All right. All right. We called it. But hey, Sam, at least you woke up in time for the baby. All right, guys. Start the prediction. Is it going to be a boy or a girl? Is it going to be a boy or is it going to be a girl? We're going to let her sleep for a moment. Wait a minute. Why does she look like a Cheeto? I have concerns now. Why does she look like a Cheeto? Y'all see it, right? It's not just me that, that sees this. Y'all see this too, right? This 
this is kind of terrifying. She looks like she's possessed by the mother plant. I mean... The mother plant is able to twerk, so I would not put it past the mother plant to possess toddlers. I'm just saying. Alright, let's, let's go give birth. Let, I'm getting away from this toddler. <laughs> we, I might make an exception and change her skin tone. Because that's kind of terrifying. Yeah, that's like permanent sunburn. Permanent sunburn. I don't know how I feel about that. Mm. Yeah, it's like the 90s, late 90s, early 2000s, really bad orange spray tans that everybody seemed to have at some point. Mm. Y'all seen the pictures. Even if you didn't have one yourself, you've seen the pictures of those that did. At one point for a couple of years, everybody was orange. Alright. Oh, that's right. We need to... This is grandkid. So our grandson's now delivering our babies. That's always interesting. Uh, it's a dream mat moose. I mean, I could see it. Maybe she's from Toddlers and Tiaras. I, she could be. She could be. You never know. Alright. Why are you watching TV? You should be giving birth. Please go give birth. And why is Polly here? And now he's acting like it's his kid. Go away. Oh my god, Polly, go away. This is not your child. Alright, doctor. Wake up, please. Wake up, thank you. See, she's not even waiting for him. She's like, I already know what to do. Hurry up or I'm going to deliver the baby myself. Although I wouldn't, I wouldn't put it past her. Okay. How did we not know that he was a medical intern already? All right. Okie doke. Come on now. It is a boy. All right, I need to go in and update the thingy Mababa really quick. So it is a boy. All right, so congrats to those that chose that. Um, so now you need to vote on if you think it's going to be twins or a twins or more or a single birth. While I up this. Ah, here it is. All right, so. Where is it? There it is. Okay, so keep in mind, so it cannot be Harry Potter, Divergent, Twilight, or Fifty Shades of Grey. Otherwise, when you redeem it, do character name and the book that it is from. So it is now open. You should be able to. All right. We got one more. We got one more. Um, one more. Yes, yeah, so one more spot. Let me put this in. Oh, I can't do more than that. All right, that works. 
All right, so um, the Star Wars books, that would have been, Star Wars would have been movies. So we wouldn't be able to use that because that was part of the movie section. I didn't even know there were Star Wars books. There Are there Star Wars books? I didn't even know there were Star Wars books. I thought it was all movies. I must Google. Um, but yes, but regardless, the, that would be considered part of movies since it is a, a movie-based series. Yeah, let me see. Uh, let me see. Yeah, because they're considered companion books. Yeah, so that would be a separate, that would be, that would have been movies still. So, yeah. Yeah, standalone books instead of like, yeah. Yeah, basic, yeah, that's exactly right, Stacey. Uh, so it, it's books that, um, weren't like, it. The Star Wars stuff are like spinoffs of the uh, movie source material. So yeah, there's Star yeah Star Wars is literally in everything. Um, actually, I don't think there's anything that Star Wars did not touch on. I don't think so. Yeah. So yeah, so if you have another one, we can go with that. Uh, let me see. Close that. Wait a minute. William Shakespeare? Huh? Oh, it's a parody. I was, it's in William Shakespeare Star Wars books. I was like, wait, what? No, it's a parody. Okay. That had me concerned. That had me drastically concerned. All right, we will go with that. Okie doke. And, oh, I almost opened it up without letting you guys fight over it. All right, there you go. Go ahead, fight over it. So we have Oompa Loompas. It, the poll is very abbreviated. So Oompa Loompas from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, uh, which that would all fall under the Roll Doll universe. Um, Watson from Sherlock Holmes or um, uh, Greg from Diary of a Wimpy Kid. I haven't read those books in a long time. Yeah, I haven't read. I remember reading those books. I was addicted to them. I would go out of my way to try to make sure I, I got my hands on them at the library. That brings back fun memories. I love it. I love it. Uh, points or bits. It is, I opened up both. I definitely opened up both. Uh, so it's, that's part of the Roll Doll universe, which would, in, which includes all the books. So Willy Wonka was, um, from the movie, the Willy Wonka movie. Um, but yeah, no, this would be part of the Roll Doll books because, like, there's... How many books did that man write? How many books did he write? He wrote... Now, he didn't write 250 books. Google really tried to tell me at first that he wrote 250 books. No, his copy sold over 250. That's how many copies he sold. How many actual books were there? Uh, children's books. Uh, 
All right, that tells me nothing. Here we go, bibliography, here we go. How many are there? You going? You really gonna tell me that if you didn't? I just want a number, I don't want the list of them. Oh wait, here we go. 19 books, uh, 12 scripts, nine nonfiction books. And a bunch of poems. All right. Yeah, but like, so any of those. So uh, James and the Giant Peach, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, Fantastic Mr. Fox, um, like the BFG, Matilda, all of those would fall under the Roll Doll universe. So all of them are, are lumped together. No, by Kinsey. Are we going with you or are you leaving us? I missed the, I was too busy looking. I missed the results. Hold on. Well, damn. Well, damn, Sam. Sam coming in here and sniping it out. What the heck? What the heck, Sam? All right, so Watson has won this one. All right, let's see. Is it twins or single? It is a single birth. All right, well. Sam be rude like that, apparently. We got birth certificate. That works. It's not twins, unfortunately. Unfortunately. So, all right. All righty then. Well, that happened. That definitely happened. All right. Wait, where's my thing? There it is. That was a fun rabbit hole to go down. Um, but so Sam and the Salty Bean were going for Watson. Uh, Stacy and Miss Kitty were going for Oompa Loompa. And Jess was going for Greg of Diary Wimpy Kid trying to help them out. I mean, that's kind of why we did the, the channel points, to give you guys places to waste your channel points, because I know a lot of you guys have a ton. That could work. That could work, Sam. That could work. All right. So, I think with that, that is where we are going to wrap up for today, because um, I need to get some food. I'm kind of hungry. No idea what I'm going to get, but I'm kind of hungry, so... Anyway, um, let me see who is live that we can go say hello to. Mm, let me see. Half these people are logging off. All right, give me a sec. All right, well... We're going to stay with Sims, I think. All right, here we go. Oh, th uh, this person's doing one of the new scenarios. So we're going to head over here. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Um, it's from Sephora, and I don't know what it's called yet. Um, I te I'm testing out a couple of different ones. So, um, But anyway, all right. Well, thank you for hanging out with me today. I do have some thank yous to do to say. Um, go back through. So, Sam, thank you for the 13 month resub. Sunny for the Sunny Creations for the raid. Um, the Any Key for the raid. Uh, Super Bucko for the uh, first time subscription with the Prime. Bride of Alton for the raid. Mrs. Kitty for the first time uh, subscription with your Prime. Um, to everybody that followed today, thank you. And thank you to all of you for hanging out with me. It has been a lot of fun. A lot of fun. We are 11 followers away from 3.9K, which is absolutely wild. Absolutely wild. So uh, the goal for this month is 4K by the, end of the, um, by the end of the month. So I still think we can get there. I still definitely think we can get there. Um, tomorrow is Elemental Legacy. And then on Friday, we'll be back to 100 Baby. So that'll be fun. Um, and yes, Sam dropped all my socials in there. I am working on stuff for YouTube. There's just a lot of stuff that I'm behind on with YouTube. So, uh, just keep an eye on it. 
things will be popping up slowly but surely. Um, if you missed any streams and you'd like to go back and watch them, I do upload all of them to the VODs channel. The um, end of set two will be out by Sunday on there. So by Sunday, everything will be caught up on the VODs channel. Um, it, so everything is about a, is going to be about a week behind. Uh, so a week after it's been on stream is when it'll show up on the VODs channel. That's kind of the goal that I'm going for. So, all right. Well, I'm going to go find some food and work on some YouTube stuff for you. So go ahead and grab your raid messages. We're going to go over and see this person who is working on, um, looks like they're doing the unlucky chef scenario. So I guess if the fire generation goes wrong, that's what you're kind of looking at so all right go ahead and grab your raid messages we're gonna go say hi to this person and thank you for hanging out with me and i will see you guys all later okay all right enjoy your evening i'll see you guys tomorrow or if i don't see you tomorrow then i will see you on friday so all right okay have a good one goodbye guys